That's enough of the good music. Turn on the royalty-free jams. Yeah, there we go. Much better, much better. Hello, welcome to a new stream. You've likely never seen a stream quite like this before, because you've never seen a game like this before. Bad way. We got in the chat, we got Alex the One 911. We got Din Den. We got Justin. We got KBH. And we got Din Den again. And we have Grognak Grognak. This game looks sick. In parentheses. Cool. Uh, it's not. But thanks for your thanks for your vote of confidence. Let's see. What's a good what's a good YouTube intro for this bad boy? Let's see. What about the good way? Yeah, I wish I was playing good way instead. Next time I'll be sure to pick up good way on sale. Hello, Bombi and Jedi Ducky. If you are a solo game developer, trying to make an Uncharted clone all by yourself is probably a bad way to go about it, and yet here we are with a game that did just that. That's pretty good, right? Let's just do one more take. If you're a solo game developer, then trying to make an Uncharted clone all by yourself is probably a bad way to go about it, but here we are with a game that does just that. It's an Uncharted clone made by one guy in Unity, I'm pretty sure. Let's play it. Reminds me of Unearthed, the trail of Ibn Battuta. Look out, deer. Oh, that was a close call. That deer almost got road killed. <laughs> you gotta respect this guy. He's dead inside. He may be dead inside, but he doesn't want to take the wildlife with him. This is so intense already. Mm -hmm. He may be dead inside, but he doesn't want to take the forest with him. So fluid. Yeah, very fluid game. Look at, look at my guy. He's a very muscle guy. He may be dead inside, but he doesn't want to take it in it. I can't say this right. He may be dead inside, but he doesn't want to take an innocent creature with him. There we go. It's funny. Oh, darn. Looks like my car is all blowed up. Will the fire hurt me? Oh, you can climb on the door. There you go. So here's my guy. He's a very uh, muscly guy. He kind of looks like Serious Sam. If Serious Sam wore business casual instead of a t-shirt. Damn it. Wish I had never started. Carlos will not let this go. Yeah, Carlos is going to be pissed. I got to turn the um, uh, volume down on the music, I think. A little bit loud. That's probably good, right? There we go. His car is in a bad way, yeah. Oh hell, looks like my car is in a bad way. Unexpected things. Unexpected things. And that, kids, is how you drive in a bad way. Yeah, seriously. How's the recording looking? Looks fine to me. Unexpected things, huh? I wasn't expecting that. Unexpected things. Wasn't expecting that. Huh, I wasn't expecting that. Ha 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 ha. Sad. What is that? Uh, sad Elrond. Sad Elrond. Nice, nice joke. Nice comedy. Sad Elrond. Unexpected things. Unexpected things. That's a, more like unexpected things in the bagging area. That's pretty good too, Justine. Unexpected things. I hate it when there's an unexpected thing in the bagging area. I hate it when there's an unexpected thing in the bagging area. There we go, that's funny. Self-checkout comedy. All right, how's the movement in this game? We got sprint, we got jump. It's pretty good, pretty fluid. It kind of reminds me of Overgrowth, the way it controls, but Overgrowth is a game where you're a rabbit. Maybe there's a way here. It's a bit of a different game. I think I can crawl through. See a crouch? Yep. Got a crouch. Do do. Do do. This came out two months ago, by the way. I think if I hook up to the branch above, I can pass. Press the Q key to get the rope and press right mouse button. Right, right mouse button. I can't read this game. Grapple swing. Eat your heart out, Nathan Drake. 
Oh, look at those. I can from here. You bet you can. Oh, baby, look at those wall outcroppings. You know what this means. Can he climb? Can he get onto him? There we go. Dun, 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 dun. Call of War as did it better. I haven't played any of the Call of War as did they really? Can it get better than this? I doubt it. His poor uh, shoulders, man. His shoulders are having a tough time. Nathan Drake makes it look so easy. What the? Press left control for climbing finish. Okay, so the game has a few bugs. I think if I hook up to the branch above, I can pass. But again, it was made by one guy, so cut him some slack. Let's try once more. I get to do the climbing again. Oh joy, here we go. I can climb from here. I can't complain though. This is not a game that I played thinking it didn't have uncharted climbing. This is a game I knew had uncharted climbing. So I cannot complain about the uncharted climbing in this one. I knew what I was getting coming into this one. It's all my fault. Maybe I should go all the way down the thing first. Let me go all the way down. There we go. I didn't go far enough on the ledge. I'm not going to say that was my fault. I'll split the blame 50-50 game. How about that? I should have climbed more. You should have functioned properly. That seems fair, I think. Okay, the jump didn't work. Let's try again. Got to line it up perfectly and then sprint. There we go. That's uncharted. Do a barrel roll. Press the C key two times to evade the attack. Oh. Carlos is men. Nathan Drake does not have a Dark Souls roll. Bad end may be able to beat Nathan Drake in a fight. Nathan Drake does not have a Dark Souls roll. Can I not get the gun? Can I have this, please? There we go. The scope renders over his head. Cute. All right, red barrel test. Here we go. <laughs> he kicked the red barrel over. He's trying to get it away from me. He's like, no, please, don't shoot it. Too late, bad guy. Did Unearthed get a sequel again? I do have Unearthed installed in case this game is one second long. I have no idea how long this game is going to be. Eat lead. Got him. This game came out two months ago. It's more of a more of a recent version of Unearth. The developers of Unearth said they're going to remake Unearth. At least gun loudness is somewhat accurate. It's a pretty loud gun. This box might get me going up. Press E key to push the box. Like Lego Star Wars, great. I like his pistol animation. He does the Han Solo thing. He throws the left hand back and points forward dramatically. He throws the left hand back and points forward dramatically. There we go. He's a real Han Solo type. Maybe this guy, yeah. Maybe this guy is inspired more by Han Solo. Because Nathan Drake is Indiana Jones guy. Maybe this is a Han Solo character. That makes sense. Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Where? How'd the game design go? Pretty good, actually. Not bad. Made some pretty decent games, I think. The gun ammo, can I get that somehow? Or am I stuck in the corner? Oh. Let's see, did I want that gun instead of the sniper? Probably. Give me the FAMAS. I won't even move. There we go. Alright, FAMAS. A real man's weapon. For a real Han Solo. What 
is this? Oh, give me the sniper again. I think I'm fine with the FAMAS. Carlos's men. Classic Carlos. He sounds like Gene Rain voice acting, so that's good. Oh boy, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta hide inside the rock like prop hunt. My plan is to hide inside the rock like prop hunt. Hopefully they'll just walk right past me. Hopefully they'll just walk right past me. Is that my knee inside of my chest? Yep, sure is. <laughs> this guy's having a bad day. Bad way is having a bad day. Okay, turn the gunshots down a little bit, please. Where's sound effects? There we go. Gotta have the voice volume up. That's very important. Okay, that didn't do anything at all. Are gunshots not sound effects? Yes, they're not. Okay. Die, Carlos's men. Yeah, it seems like you want the sniper rifle. You need that scope. Can I get a JPEG of a scope to help me aim, please? Thanks. Is he holding a knife? That guy was holding a combat knife. Man, Carlos. Carlos's men are not very good, I gotta say. I'm not impressed. This is the kind of help bad guy industries can afford these days. How are you, Carlos's man? Brr. Was this game tested by the winners of a reality game show? Oh boy. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Can you swap shoulders? You cannot, okay. Don't know why I thought that was gonna be possible. Maybe you can and the uh, the key binding is wrong. Maybe you can. Never say never. Give me the M4. Give me that M4, please. Please and thank you. There we go. You have made the note that scoping is just zooming in over the shoulders, correct? I mean, that's just, that's called zooming in in any third person game. What game is this? this is Uncharted 5. There's a new one coming out soon. I got the early beta access. Three days ago. Dude, animals are always running out in front of this guy's car. Those two cats almost died. Bad end is a man traumatized by running over too many animals. He's cursed. He asked a witch. He asked a witch to give Look him big who muscles. We have here. But in return, history professor she made Michael. him a. Or should I say? She made him accidentally formal. slaughter animals wherever Hello. he goes. There you go. His How long has it been? Four years. Since you're back here after all this time, I assume things didn't go so well. You know, my employment at the university was terminated after the last job. So, yes, former professor. Right. The last job. Oh, we're playing as Jeff Winger. you out must really hate you. You don't have any idea who it is, do you? This guy is almost as no. charming as Jeff I Winger. I'd make them pay. So what he do looks I like the creator of Family Guy. He kind of does. Missed me. I'm a little short on cash. Uh, can you lend me some money? Hey, Lois, I'm in an Uncharted money. game. Hey, Lois, look, <laughs> I'm in Uncharted. Does it say Bobby's bank? Peter, you can't be in Uncharted, <laughs> Peter. Please, Bob, don't you think I tried the bank? No one gave me a loan. I need money fast. How much are we talking about? $150,000. 150000 That's a lot of money. My wife, Clara, is very sick, Bob. What is Carlos I'm leaning desperate. his hand on? She needs surgery. You need to understand. I don't think Carlos understands I'm what kind of chair he's wife. sitting in. I've known you a long time. We did a lot of business together. If you agree, I have a job. If we can make a deal, I'll try to get that money for your wife, Clara. Go ahead. What's the job? I have this map. 
The man who brought it said it was the map of a missing treasure. It belonged to a king called Mensa Moza. Check it, it seems out. today that real? all you see you is uninspired knockoff to watch on Mansa this stream. People have been chasing it for years. Mansa Musa was the richest man on earth. They say he had ancient books and tons of gold. If I'm more interested in the books. Real, it points to an immense treasure. A spot in Mexico is marked. Yeah, I heard about that too. If you find this treasure for me, I'll give you the money. Plus, I heard Carlos had a copy of this. Oh, map. this guy is not Carlos. So if you agree to do the job, you must hurry. And you know what will happen if you try to screw me. Deal. I accept. Bum, bum, bum. And then he flew from the U.S. to Mexico. There we go. And then he flew from the USA to Mexico with no sound effects. No JPEG of an airplane, just a line. It took Mexico a few seconds to load in. It took Mexico... Mexico? It took Mexico a few seconds to load in, but once he was there, he found it very beautiful. Dang it, I messed that one up too. Look <laughs> at extra long route, he really did. It took Mexico a few seconds to load in, but once he was there, he found it very beautiful. There we go. Which game has better Mexico graphics? This or the new Modern Warfare? I'm leaning this. I'm also leaning Gauntlet Made. Thank you, Gauntlet Made, for subscribing. Where's the yellow tint? Oh, that's true. There we go. Now it's Mexico. Editor, put the Breaking Bad tint on there. Why was the landmass blue and the water brown? That's a very good question. I don't think I've ever seen a map like that. That is a huge deagle. It is pretty big. This is like Death Stranding. It's like low roar. Oh, dude, is this low roar? This reminds me of Death Stranding. Editor, put a put a put a funny low roar subtitle on him going over the mountain there. Walter, put away your grappling hook, Walter. I'm not playing Uncharted with you right now, Walter. Train bridge. Do I go? This way. Look, this looks the wrong way, doesn't it? Is there a map? No. There's a fortress over there. I'll go around the corner. He has a mighty sprint. He's very determined. So far, so good. There's no survival crafting. There may be survival crafting later. You can never count it out for sure. But as of right now, it just seems to be a normal Uncharted game, which I very much appreciate. When are you gonna fall out of a plane? That's in the third one. This is the first one. Hello, I am Bad Way Developer. Woo, Bad Way Developer. This is the end of the Let's road. go. I must proceed on What's up, Bad Way Developer? What's your name? Oh yeah, because it's Monty Gaming. Because it's Monty Eldass, nice. Am I going to the castle? I think I'm going to the castle. Are you going to continue the Thez Bezda Chronicles? Yeah, I'm going to continue those. I'm going to keep going with that one. Sorry for English, no problem, I understand you. Let's explore the ancient ruins. Yeah, he's the actual developer. He made it. Like I said, it's a one-man job. Press the Z key to see enemies behind the wall. Are the crates the enemies? No. Press and hold four key to throw grenades. And press left mouse button. Okay. Explosion grenade. The best kind of grenade. I hate flashbangs. Oh, there's a guy. I see one. Oh my god, he did a huge jump. He really wanted to get to that red barrel. Can you blame him? Oh, 
Oh, you're a game developer? Name five games. Oh my god, uh. Oh. Uh. Crap. I ran out of bullets. Try again. Let's use the M4 this time. Use the real gun. Also gotta see the enemy behind the wall. Targets down. I'm peeking, I'm peeking. Come around the pillar. This game requires a careful application of combat tactics. And there we go. <laughs> the music is pretty peaceful. I like the music. He's very sneaky. Dun 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 dun. Grognag, Grognag, thank you for subscribing. You can be Grognard. The famous thing people always say they are when they're old and they play D&D. Am I done in the fortress? There may be something in the fortress. Just a chill day shooting people in the fort. Oh no. <laughs> His poor spine. I'm sorry, bad way. I'm sorry, Robert, bad way. You're gonna need to see a doctor. Oh, I've been bamboozled. The treasure of Mansa Musa isn't behind that one pillar. Let me check the other pillar. Tennis Frisbee, thank you for gifting us up to him. You are now subscribed. Go back down those stairs, dog. I'm just exploring. I'm just making sure there's no gems. I gotta get gems. I'm a big gem fan, as you know. Can you climb up to this, maybe? What's, what's his vertical? Okay, not that high. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go. Reverse. Mm, I need to turn this to open the Press door. one key first to turn valve. Oh no. <laughs> his eyes. His eyes came out of his skull. Oh. <laughs> when you see the treasure of Mansa Musa. Awooga! Hubba 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 hubba. <laughs> Jaw drops on the floor. When you see the treasure of Mansa Musa, he was very surprised by that valve. He just really likes turning. Who doesn't love turning valves? Did I open the gate? I'm not even sure. I think I did. It looks open now. Maramosa? Yeah, I did. Oh, he died. Mar Maramosa, thank you for subscribing. He broke his neck falling down the cliff. Alright, come here. I'm ready for you this time. Headshot? Ooh, headshot. Easy. Pixel perfect. Grab reload. Ah. There we go. A vow? Does this mean the water's gonna come back on? Hey, you here when the water's gonna come back on? Hey, you here when the water's gonna come back on? Hey, you here when the water's gonna come back on? Oh, there's two guys over there. Crap. Crap. There we go. RJ20, thank you for subscribing. There we go. Let's turn that valve again. 
This guy does love turning the valve. It is his favorite activity. Oh, get off the wall. Get off the wall. Get off the wall. There we go. I need to turn this to open the door. Oh, nope. Hang on. Hold it. There we go. Nope. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Can I have the pistol? Oh, yeah. You can't have the pistol equipped. There we go. There's the gate. Okay, the gate is up now. Can I, How high will it go? <laughs> Can I make the gate go into the stratosphere? To the sky, gate. Okay, he almost died, but he's fine. You try turning a valve with a gun in your hand. Yeah, I know. It's, it doesn't. It doesn't seem easy. This guy will make it easy for me. Yeah, will get in. Behold the shiny yellow mobile. Eat your heart out, Forza. Eat your heart out, Gran Turismo and Forza. Bad End is the superior driving game. Ooh, a ramp. Oh, not a ramp. Whatever, it's fine. Through the tunnel. Oh, tight turn, tight turn. Hopefully the car can't take damage. That'd be a problem. This is the end of the road. I must proceed on foot. Yeah, the in-game English is fine. I understand what they're saying. Do you drink water? Yes, I do drink. I'll drink some water right now. I'll drink water on stream live. delicious are you giving up on the car that easy that's true you can't drink water on stream that's against TOS I want to try this let's go up the hill can we climb this mountain? I don't know. Higher now than ever before. Come on. Come on. It's four-wheel drive. Off-road. It's off-road. Come on. Off-road. We can do it. Come on. It's moving slowly. Oh, I got pushed back down. Oh. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Looks like it's the end of the road for the bad guys. I think this map is fake, or it's pointing to another clue. I'll find out in a bit. Come on. There we go. Can the car fit through the Dark Souls archway? Let's find out. Oh, oh, yeah. Dark Souls would be a lot easier if you had a car. If I had a little convertible. I could just run over it, Ornstein, and smell. They'd get crushed. There we go. Oh god, a stairway. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Needs more speed. Hang on. I need more. I need more of a boost. All right, here we go. Come on. Come on. Yeah, it's not working. It was fun while it lasted, car. We had a good run. Oh no, the car won't get off the stairs now. I can't get out of the car because the railing is blocking the door. There we go. Alright, car, we had a good run. I gotta go back to shooting bad guys, though. It's the only life I've ever known. Bad guys around. Ah, 
I can climb from here. Aha, the Assassin's Creed plank. I should have known. Uh oh, keep your balance. Oh, there we go. Another one. Dun 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 dun. Oh. Is the game expensive for USA? Uh, nine dollars. Eh, it's kind of a lot. I, if you made it, I'd say if you made it four ninety nine, it probably would sell a little bit better. That's a good price for this kind of stuff. Not even painted yellow, I know. Oh, no, 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 don't keep falling, don't keep falling. Whoa, 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 okay, he's fine. He's fine. <laughs> don't miss, mm -hmm. Take the risk. Take the risk. Oh, there it is. I didn't see that. Oh. Crap. You can do it. Come on. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> Dead again. All right, this time I got it. This time I know. I can climb from here. Can you though? Just gotta line it up right. It's it's this is like um it's like getting over with Bennett Foddy. Just gotta line it up right. It's all on the wrist. Okay, do this and then there we go. There we go. See, I told you. I told you I could do it. Carlos's men. Uh oh. Carlos has a lot of men. Can you see me? No. What if I just sneak right in? What if I just go in, Carlos? What do you gotta do, huh? Yes. Where is the treasure? Where is the treasure? Are those, is that the way we're gonna stay shut? Still line the symbols with this mechanism. All right, Bleak Falls Barrow. Here we go. The clues I saw outside. Oh, there's clues outside. Crap! I gotta go find the clues. I do gotta fight Carlos's men. All right, Carlos's men, come here. <laughs> he can crouch really good. Lois, this is more intense than modern warfare. Strafing, I'm strafing. A Carlos man. There we go. Now, where's some clues? I saw the ancient rune over here on the left. There's an M there. We got an M. Any clue on that one? Doesn't seem like it. There's a weird M. Okay, MP. For multiplayer, has the multiplayer mode. Carlos's men. Oh man, Carlos's men are brutal. All right, Carlos's men. Let's try this again. Let's try again, Carlos's men. Let's get one of these. We might be able to just go inside now because we have the three clues. We have sperm, MP, and M. Oh man. What difficulty is this on? Is it on easy mode? It's probably on easy mode. Carlos's men. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna get the drop on him this time. There we go. Now I'll go inside. See no? 
Excuse me, sir. Do you know about me? There we go. Yes. Where is the treasure? Okay, so it was it was sperm you MPM. The symbols with this mechanism. So, sperm. Who's I saw outside? Where's the M? Help me open this door. There's the normal M. So we'll turn the middle one. Turn the middle one this way. There we go. I hear Carlos's man crap. They're coming. They hear me solving the puzzle. Okay, we gotta move the just the bottom one or the top one? Let's find out. Probably bottom. There we go. Now where's MP? There it is. Give it two rotations. Give the old one two as they say. Perfect. Has the exact same mechanics as PUBG. True, we're just have PUBG shooting. Just as I suspected. Let's see if there's anything inside this. A new map. This must be Brazil. Oh, oh no. The bad guys captured him. Ah, oh, my head. He's been captured. Where am I? I was looking at the map. I remember <laughs> They put him out with the garbage. They put him out with a bunch of trash bags. I need to get out of here. They just threw him in the dumpster. They just threw him in the trash. Yeah, not so funny when it happens to you, is it, bad guy? Ow, my head! Ow, my head, get off! Yeah, not so fun when it happens to you, is it? Looks like you're the one that got put in the trash. Sorry, bad guy. Looks like you're the one that got put in the trash. You can kick the box. You can kick the box. I repeat, you can kick the box. This game is the best game ever. I desire... Oh, boy. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hoomst. Hoomst. Ah, you. I should have known it was you. I want to take this box through the whole level. My goal is to escort this crate through the entire mission, but can it move? There we go. Maybe, maybe a crouch walk is better. Okay, he keeps going over it. Keeps standing on it, whatever. I don't care that much. Carlos's men. Oh, there's Carlos's men. There he is. Coming out, you coward. Perfect shot. See that? One shot, one kill. I wonder if that six means anything. Four. That might be a puzzle later. We'll find out. Good reflection, good reflection. Urban Factory 3. I think it's more of an Urban Factory 7 vibe, personally. This is Carlos's headquarters. It's where him and his bad guys hang out. Can I climb this dumpster? I don't know. Can I go through the green door, maybe? No. Look for a climbable thing. I probably gotta climb. How about this? Nope. 
Maybe these weird pipe things can be climbed? Hmm. So I came out, turned, and shot that guy. So you probably do go this way. Feels like I can climb this. Oh, there we go. I'm stupid. I'm really dumb. <laughs> Worst gamer alive. At least I Han soloed him. Anymore. Oh, Carlos is man. <laughs> Aha. My intrepid instincts are too much for them to handle. Floor is lava, be careful. <gasps> Carlos's man, he's around this corner. Can I hop the fence? Nope. Over the logs. Oh, a pipe? That's gotta be climbable, right? Pipes are always climbable. Now I have to Google what intrepid means. <laughs> intrepid is a good word. It's a good word if you're gonna be playing a lot of Uncharted-esque games. It's a good word to use. I was inside of his ears, hang on. Get back in the ear. <laughs> no, this is a message. Hello, Uncharted. Welcome to the ear exam. Yep, just as I expected. Your brain is hollow. Yeah, I see the box. Where we push this box to? Probably just over this fence. <laughs> Car called Fearless. It's a four door sedan. You don't know where they're going with that sedan. They can go anywhere. They could be doing some crazy stuff. So I gotta I can't bring the box over that fence, so no. Oh here we go. So it's a Mario Sunshine. Nice jump. Oh hell, Carlos's man. I'm peeking, I'm peeking. Crap. I'm peeking. I can't tell if the bullets are like hit scan or if they're like simulated from the gun. I'm not sure. Oh, Carlos is dead. Play Delfino Plaza theme. Dun 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 dun. Will the propane explode? No. It's gotta be red propane. Only red brand propane explodes. We should know that by now. Naughty Dog made this. Now where's the box? There must be another road. Wrong way, I guess. Aha. We'll take the sewer path. Now we're in the trenches. How do you know it's Carlos's men? It could just be random people, true. It could just be random people, not necessarily Carlos's men. I could have just shot some innocent people. I'd have no way of knowing. Oh yeah, that's Carlos's men for sure. That guy was totally Carlos's man. And I'm dead. <laughs> they need a shirt that says Carlos's men. Mm -hmm. They need a uniform. Oh yeah, that guy is totally Carlos's man. No question, no doubt.
Jump shot. Ooh, easy kill. That guy was stuck. I did him a favor. What? <laughs> I needed to let my health regenerate, I guess. All right, try again, Carlos, man. The checkpoints are good. Good checkpoints. Normally, a game like this would have terrible checkpoints. I gotta go across it. I don't go down there. Duh. There we go. Oh. Oh. Okay. Careful. Be very careful on chart. You're on thin ice, buster. Looks like no one's sitting on the... <laughs> no one's sitting on the dilapidated rooftop. No one's enjoying their break, it would seem. Here we go. Out of the way, crate. I think all bad guys should wear the chef outfit from Hydrophobia. If all bad guys are just dressed as chefs. If all bad guys were Linguini from Ratatouille, that would really help. Oh, that's a lot of Carlos men. Holy crap. Carlos got a lot of men today. Come here. Oh, out of ammo. That's not good. Okay. Make your shots count, soap. Account for the Coriolis effect. Account for the Carlo Seolis effect. Gotta go for the one tap headshots. Am I not hitting him? Looks like it's gotta be headshots. Ramirez, last mag, make it count. All right, give me your gun, Carlos, man. I need a weapon. Cortana, I need a weapon. Cortana, give me a weapon. There we go. Thanks, Cortana. I will give you a key for my other game. Game name, Commando Hero. Yeah, I'll play Commando Hero. Is it the same as this? Are you a commando? It's a rumbling car. Oh. All right. Back to the reverse map. Back to the reverse map. Our hero keeps heading south. Fun fact, there are only three nations in the Western Hemisphere. Fun fact, there's only three nations in the Western Hemisphere. USA, Mexico, and Brazil. I want a Carlos Mann t-shirt. Lost in the Amazon jungle. Uh-oh, he's lost. Oh, geez, how'd I end up in the Amazon River? I was trying to find the ancient treasure. I took a wrong turn somewhere back there. Uh, do you have, um... Monty, do you have a Twitter? Because I have a Twitter. You can just DM me on Twitter. That's probably the easiest way to do that. Commando hero, he refuses to wear underwear. Mm -hmm. All of his men are named Carlos. Mm -hmm. That's part of the oath. Seymour Bunsen, thanks Seymour. Actually responding to people asking you to come to Brazil, yeah. I was like, it's about time. I gotta show up down there. I gotta make an appearance. Thanks Bunsen Burner. Here we go. Oh no. The plank was hard enough, now I gotta walk across the tree? Okay, we're good, we got this, we got this. Careful, careful. Bingo.
Why did I come up here? Oh, there's a ledge right there. Here we go. Ready? There we go. We are all Carlos. I went to Brazil and saw someone named Carlos. Really? Wow, that's a crazy story, dude. I can't believe it. Hmm. So now that he's here, did I not get here before? Oh yeah, I couldn't climb that thing, okay. Silence pistol? Carlos's men have no chance now. Carlos's men are doomed now. Give me, give me the Perun X16, that sounds good. Big Perun fan. And give me the silence pistol. Look out, Carlos's men. You're gonna get a headshot so bad. Crouch among plants to hide from the enemy. Crouch among the plants to hide from the enemy. Hey, does our giant novelty fake bush moving around seem suspicious to you? Hey, do you see that guy in a white shirt crawling around through our giant novelty fake plastic bushes? Yeah, I see him, but... Carlos isn't paying me enough to stop him. Carlos isn't paying me enough to stop him. He didn't even buy us uniforms. He just said, come to work in a t-shirt. All right, stealth time. Here we go. Hang on. I'm gonna stealth this guy so hard. Crap. 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 Come on. <laughs> Get him. Nice stealthing, thanks. It's my speciality. Ooh, headshot. Oh, crap. I've been spotted. All oh, hell. Here we go. With Carlos's men defeated, I'm free to explore the ancient fountain. This is my new aim trainer. Screw actual aim lab. I'm gonna use this. Ah, here we go. The sprint jump is pretty fun. He goes a good distance. Oh, I hear Carlos's men. And they heard me too. Chancellor, stealthing is our speciality. He just pulls out a shotgun and starts shooting it. Crap. Mm. How many grenades? There we go. Have some of this, Carlos's men. Yeah, did that get him? All I need is a window to get over the wall. There we go. I think I got the yellow guy. Are they all down? Yeah. Carlos's men have been eliminated once more. Take that, Carlos. Is there a pushable? Yeah, there it is. Give it a shove. What if they're Josh's men? No, they're Carlos's men, don't worry. Carlos has men all over the world. Carlos has men in all three Western nations. There's no chance that those were Josh's men. They definitely belong to Carlos. Try again. We are all Carlos's man. Go. Yeah. Gotta angle this one. <laughs> Carlos Incorporated, yeah, exactly. Here's a Carlos has been in this very chat. I oh, know I backed off it. It does feel very overgrowthy. Like your your guy is completely simulated in this. He 
he's a, a physical object in the world. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. This gun looks kind of cool. I like the skin on that thing. Unlike Outfall, this game actually has physics. Mm -hmm. Hey, Outfall 2, the first second bomb, was the best game ever. It's beloved by fans and critics alike. Is it a laser beam or just a seam in the water? I think it's a seam. Uh oh, uh oh, here we go, here we go. This is where the game gets good. There it is. The Amazon Temple. I'm quite sure I'll find Jeff Bezos inside. <laughs> yeah, it seems about right. Yeah, this seems about right. This is about the average working conditions inside of an Amazon warehouse. <laughs> Hang on, walk it, walking through a puddle makes that funnier. Yeah, that seems about right. Yeah, that seems about right. This is the average working conditions. This is the average working conditions inside an Amazon warehouse. The large bodies of water are the sweat from the employees who labor without air conditioning. The large bodies of water are the sweat from all the employees who labor without air conditioning. By the way, subscribe to Oboshoes Games with Twitch Prime. I like the gunplay in Warzone 2, but I hate everything else. Should I buy it for normal multiplayer? It's okay. I mean, it's a lot of money, though. 70 bucks. If you take too many days off, Bezos rips your heart out like Kali Ma. <laughs> Subscribe to Oboshoes Games on Twitch with... Twitch Prime, crap. Subscribe to Oboshoes Games on Twitch with Twitch Prime, by the way. There we go. Editor put that in. It's funny. It's funny because he made fun of Amazon, but Amazon still pays not even that much of his paycheck, honestly. I could I could become un-Twitch partnered, and it would be very annoying, but I could do it. Oh, do I got to go across the pillars? I think I do. Yeah, I definitely got to do that. Okay. I don't know about sweat. The water looks pretty yellow. Oh, yeah, you're right. I forgot they don't have bathroom breaks either. So in this game, water does not block fall damage, there it which is. is good to know. The Amazon Temple. All right, back to Bezos. Let's get back, back to the Bezos. Can you imagine if Bezos spent his days like Elon and trolled Twitch streams? That'd be amazing. Your stream sucks, bro. Lego falling apart sound, uh-huh. Hmm, can't reach that one. There's one I can reach. There we go. I line it up, give it a jump. Perfect, first try. Flawless. Masterpiece. Oh, oh, I, oh, I gotta go all the way around. Oh no, oh boy, I was close. They're really giving it to you on this one. No such thing as a free jump. Focus, focus. No! Why didn't he grab it? Ugh. So I gotta hit space again? I think I had to hit space every time. There it is. I right, grapple, speed run, speed the run, speed Amazon run. I got this. Temple. Speed run. Why did he fall? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on, hang on. Speed run, speed run, speed run. Grapple out. <laughs> okay, slow run, slow there run. There it is. Bum, bum, the bum, Amazon bum, 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 
makes you qualified to work here at Amazon? I have five years of parkour experience. So, uh, what makes you qualified to work here at Amazon? Uh, I have five years of parkour experience. I've played every Assassin's Creed game. Welcome to the team. Sounds good. Welcome to the team. Grab your piss bottle and get out there on that floor. Grab your piss bottle and get out there on that floor. <laughs> it's funny. Come on, come on. There we go. Hit the hit space. That was the key. Oh, careful, careful. There might be a Carlos man around here. I wonder if Carlos works at Amazon. That's his backstory. Carlos's backstory for why he's the bad guy is he's a disgruntled Amazon employee. This temple must be at least 1,000 years old. It's a lot of years. Give me the sniper. Sniper's the best gun. The precision sight picture. Die, Francis from Left 4 Dead 1. Die, Francis from Left 4 Dead 1. No chance. 1,000? Yeah, it's not that old. <laughs> it's really not that old. Yeah, it's pretty old. If I, if I saw a thousand year old temple, I'd be impressed. I think that Francis. Bald Francis with no beard. <laughs> Poor Carlos's man. He was two days from retirement. Carlos Make an Amazon man. joke next time you're pushing the box around? Oh, good idea. That's solid. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's doing that? Who's doing that? Ooh, headshot. Oh, it didn't hit him. There we go. Easy kill. Poor yellow guy. Yellow guys have no chance in this game. Oh, Carlos the man. He was on the phone with Carlos' wife and Carlos' son. Yeah, we're almost done securing the 1,000-year-old temple. We'll be home in time for the holidays. Don't you worry. Oh, cutscene, okay. Stop right there. I said stop. Don't run, or I will shoot. Oh, is it gonna be a chase scene? <laughs> Come on, knock it off. He was just mildly annoyed. Getting shot at is a minor inconvenience for Bad End. He's run over several deers. Come here, map. Oh, that was close. Stop! Come on, stop it! Stop shooting at me! Man, he's being mean. He's a big meanie. Oh, I gotta, I gotta use this. Oh crap! Get on, get on. The map is getting away. Get the map. Can he slide? There we go. Oh, hang on. The beat picked up. A huge gap. Whoa! I had to grapple. Crap! I just realized I had to grapple. I just realized it was a grapple pit. Okay, now I know the course though. I know the course, so I'm good. I can do better this time. Hmm. Or not. <laughs> My default jumping sound is Bionicle the game for GameCube Tahu jumping sound, by the way. That's why I try to replicate. <laughs> This is not going good. I'm doing much worse than last time. The map might get away. Get on the branch, get on the branch. Crap. We can't let that map fall into the wrong hands. That being Carlos's hands. I got the grapple out early this time. I'm not gonna make it, I'm not gonna make it. Carlos! 
Carlos! Go! Go! Go, bad end, go! Too late. The map got away. Guess I need momentum on the grapple, maybe? Oh, there he is, I see the guy. Come here. I think he despawned around the corner. Very clever, bad guy, very clever. Perfect, flawless, flawless. There we go, it's a huge time save, huge time save. Oh, I didn't want to get on that early, crap. Crap. There goes my time save. Can I go that way, maybe? That way might be faster. I'll try that next time. Hopefully I won't fail again, though. I won't fail this again. Go. I want to go across the pit. I guess I'm going to go the other way, because he won't go across that pit. Get back here, Carlos. There we go. No momentum loss. Look at that. I'm becoming a pro. What's a speed run more record for this, I wonder? Mighty crouch, don't crouch. Oh, nope. Stay on the thing. Ah, crap. Come on, bad end. I right, go this way. Oh, that's the wrong way. Crap. Oh, no. He's dead. Okay, so it's, it's all in the grapple. I gotta figure out how to make that grapple work. I'll just have it equipped, I guess. I like the sound effect equipping sound. It's very Metal Gear. His nemesis is good front. There hasn't been a good front yet. There's only been an enemy front and the home front. No one's ever made good front. Come on, I gotta find a better method for the branch. Oh, oh. that was close. Okay, let's see. There's Battlefront? True, there is Battlefront. Now, how do I do this? Stand. Grapple. And then hook. Almost. I don't know what I did differently that time, but he almost did it. That's good. I guess standing there is what helped. Can you grapple while running? Probably. That's what I was doing. It wasn't going very well. Can you grapple, walk back, and go? I probably can. Careful, careful. Okay, about the same as last time. The beat will kick in about now. All right, grapple. Back up. And brr, 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 brr. he can't sprint. Okay. What? What? You can't sprint while the grapple's out. It looks like. Sure is puzzling. At this point, I'm just arguing with the grapple hook. I'm like, come on, come on, grapple hook, just go. In air, press space. Okay.
onto the branch. Over the knob. This knobby trunk is vexing me greatly. All right, here we go. In air, press space. Here we go. Hook it up. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. Now catch the map. Go. Go. I don't know where this guy is, but we got to get him. Oh, yes. Okay, that was it. Oh no. Oh no, he escaped using the famous jungle train. Oh, <gasps> train mission. Yes. You know I love a good train mission. This will go very well, I'm sure. <laughs> Game of the year. Game of the year confirmed. Only Uncharted 2 has a train mission. The rest of them don't even have it. Making this game better than like Making this game better than 75% of all Uncharted games. Hello, Crappy Village. That's where the Amazon workers sleep. If only a developer was brave enough to put a train mission in a sewer level. Yeah, we can only hope. We can only dream. Oh, do I wanna go up? I wanna go up, probably. Yeah, there we go. And watch out for branches. If I know anything about trains, is that branches will get you. Oh, Carlos is man, crap. Oh crap, get down, get down, get down, get down. Whew. Carlos's man was quick on the draw there. He's pretty good. That's basically Metro. Does Metro have a train mission though? Metro does have several missions where you're on a turret section. It doesn't have a navigating, a movement, a moving train from front to back though. Oh, whoa, Carlos, man. Whoa, takedown animation, yes. Uncharted 4 sucks compared to this. I should have looked where I was going. Be careful of Carlos's train. Yeah, I should've watched out for the train. Okay, so we gotta be very careful when it comes to the Carlos's men. They're still just as deadly as ever. Trains in Metro were scrapped and taken apart, I think. I don't care about the lore reason. The lore can be whatever it wants. The stupid zombie guys should start their own train. In my Metro YouTube video, all the comments are like, oh, they're not zombies. They're mutants. Throughout the entire game, they're called mutants. They're never called zombies once. Why do you keep calling them zombies? <laughs> I was like, because they're zombies. They're not zombies. All right, one Carlos man down. There he is. Come here, Carlos's man. Ooh, in the back. Unfortunate. Oh, we fell off the train. Nice. Adios, Carlos. Headshot. Easy kill. Nice. There was a guy standing right behind him. Easy kill. There we go. No, 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 no. Oh, I almost fell on the tracks. This time I got back. Oh. Click on the draw. The hip fire hero. He does have a very Han Solo esque movement, which I do like. But they're not zombies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're zombies. Oh, don't die. Did that kill me? Okay, no, I'm fine. You never can tell with small drops in this game. Editor, put like five million spine cracking sound effects on that. 
Oh crap, here comes the bridge. Or the tunnel. Any Carlos men? No, no Carlos men around here. Lord of the Rings is my favorite zombie novel. Yeah, when all those zombies attack the army, that's crazy. Aragorn goes and gets those zombies to help him out. Non-odorized liquefied petroleum gas. Dang. What, they can shoot me right here? That's not good. I have no recourse. Can I get up there? No. The train is literally going in a circle. So is a train in Uncharted 2 if you stay on it long enough. It's cleverly disguised, but not that cleverly. Get down, get down, get down. Get off the train, get off the train. There we go. All right, Carlos's man, come here. So are all looping trains in games, except Red Dead. Red Dead, the train missions are on a timer, so those don't loop. Crap. Got I falling over? Yeah, all train missions loop. The Hitman 3 train mission loops. Anything where the anything where you can um, theoretically stay on the train as long as you want. Holy crap! By the way, anything where you can theoretically stay on the train as long as you want is a looping train. Okay, once again, good checkpoint. Enemy front does not have that good checkpoint. That guy wasn't even trying to shoot me. He was trying to leave. He was a passenger. He's like, yeah, I'm just someone on the train. I heard the, the, train. I heard the train was kind of dangerous because of Carlos's men. So I brought a gun. keeps happening. I keep doing that. I'll flank him. In the old flank and spank. Whoa! I think he got run over by the train. Poor guy. Two guys. I got a vision one. Two tangos. It's a NASCAR train. This train only turns left. You have grenades? I do have grenades. I prefer the satisfying gunplay, though. Oh, more yellow bars. Never a good sign. So, see, we, we do have yellow guides, just not in the temple. The train has the yellow bar in this game. Oh, there's the front of the train. Hang on, Carlos's men are nearby. I can feel them. Oh, come on. That wasn't even that far. That's a good battle. Oh my god, is that his eye? Oh no, it's a bullet decal. It was a bullet decal on his face. I thought his eye was hanging out. And let me get my gun out real quick. Okay, now we can have a battle. That guy's Zuckerberg. He's trying to make a deal with Amazon. We can't let this happen. We must bust up the big tech monopoly before it's too late. Two more guys. Nothing I can't handle. Francis and Mark Zuckerberg. Part of Carlos's team. The train is shipping meta VR goggles. Yes. They're being fulfilled by Amazon, but manufactured by Zuckerberg. Dear God. The most dangerous enemy is 250 centimeters. Mm -hmm. Okay, carefully fall. There we go. Much better. The front of the train draws near. Oh. There's nowhere to run to. I don't want to shoot you. Give me the map. 
<laughs> Looks like he did want to shoot him. This must be the pirate island. I need to jump. Wait, he actually train. did shoot him? I thought there was gonna be like a mysterious third party that shot him from behind the box, but no, he just killed him. He gave him like half a second to surrender and just shot him in the head. Then just changed his mind. And just changed his mind. Nice day. Oh boy, Zanzibar. That's a good Halo map. He did give There's him a chance, a boat yeah. On the shore. I could take it to reach Pirate Island. Pirate Island. Damn. He says it literally as he was shooting. What's Carlos's men doing here? Carlos's men, no! I can't believe Carlos's men are here. Let me get the binoculars. That'll help. Does that replace my pistol? Oh no, I just have him. Okay. A button is binoculars. Let's see. Is it one? Is it two? Is it three? Is it four? That's a grenade. I don't want an explosion grenade. Is it just aiming? Nah. It's probably not important. It probably doesn't matter. Q? Aha. Hmm. I got a visual on Carlos's men. Let's do this the quiet way. Was that the Metal Gear sound? It does sound very Metal Gear. Very Snake-esque UI. Barrel, yeah! They shot the barrel themselves, that wasn't even me. A weapon to surpass Carlos's men. Invincible. He can't be killed. This guy's too strong. Oh my god. Come here. AK, there we go. Now we're talking. Survive this, idiot. Where'd he go? Achima unlock respect in all caps. Yeah, you better respect me. You better respect me. I gave the bad guy a fair chance. He should have surrendered the map. It's his fault. Okay, the AK bullets do damage, making the AK the most valuable gun. Keep the AK at all costs. Such a lust for Carlos has been. There it is, the Pirate Island. That's a good boat. That's a cool boat right there. I'll hide inside the cove. <laughs> Play, I don't want to shoot you as he bows down the goons. Mm -hmm. Come on, spawn with the AK. Oh, no, no AK, back to the M4, dang it. Pirate's Island. These pirates are about to have a bad day. Bum 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 Hmm. Last time I saw a gate, it required a valve. This one's a bit different though. Probably better than Tiny Tina Pirate Island, probably true. It probably is much shorter, and therefore better. When I'm judging how good a level in Borderlands 3 and Tiny Tina is, I want to know how short the mission is. The shorter it is, the better it is. That's really what I'm looking for. Alright, don't die when you fall. There we go. Oh crap, Carlos's men could be around any corner. Oh, this is the gate. Okay, so yeah. 
keep going this way, probably. Okay, there's the ancient bridge. There's the aqueduct of the Romans. The pirates built that for their pirate stuff. I've heard legends, but I never thought I'd see it in real life. Take down the dread pirate Epstein. Welcome to Epstein's Pirate Island. Carlos's men. They oh, arrived God. before me. No, not Carlos's men. It can't be. Here we go again. Oh. Raise your hand if you saw that coming. Carlos's men. They arrived before me. There we go. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Get down, get down. Carlos and his dastardly men. Did I get him? Okay, they're good for now. I'm in the clear for now, but I gotta keep my eye out for more of Carlos's men. They arrived here before me. Oh, there they are. Respect. Oh no, he's Andy Circus. I can't swim. Not Kino. Kino, no. I hope Kino becomes an Inquisitor. And has a red lightsaber and spins it and goes, whoa, 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 I will kill you, Ezra from Clone Wars. Here we go. There's the white gamer paint. There's the gamer paint. I was wondering where the gamer paint was this whole game. Hmm. Is it not gamer paint? Maybe it's not. Is there a grapple around these parts? Up here looks promising. really is the mystery of the pirate island. I'm, I definitely cannot drop down there. It's definitely instant death. I can't go over this wall, though. Close up of Makarov. I could just go around it. I could just go down here. That works, too. The door is shut, though. Uh-oh. Maybe over here is the answer. We should go to the bad Weezer death. Island. A bad death. What? Oh, skeleton. <laughs> Poor skeleton. He got turned into a pointing sign. Dear God, Carlos's men made these guys into skeletons. Dear God, Carlos's men got turned into skeletons by the pirates of the Pirate Island. Just what exactly am I getting into here? Hey, look, it's a house from Skyrim. <laughs> this is Bellathor's general goods store. I'll just pop right in and buy some health potions. Coleco Jack Silent. Coleco Jack. Those are definitely like mine flowers, right? They'll kill you? No? Okay. Look at these two door house styles. Bellathor's first name, Carlos. Dun dun dun. Bellathor, Carlos. Island in the sun. A war happened here. Oh, where? Oh, there's one. Carlos is man. Glad to see you're still alive and not a skeleton. Allow me to fix that for you. I'll use the window to get a better angle. Okay, I'm almost dead. Hang on. I underestimated Carlos's men. I think I got that guy. Yeah, there he is. He fell. He fell. Tell me, where's Gandalf? How much desire to speak with him? Gotta check every corner here in the Undeadburg. 
The Balrog of Morgoth. What did you say? The Balrog of Morgoth. What did you say? Ooh, treasure chest. What's in the treasure? What's in the treasure? What's in the treasure? Open the treasure. Can you not open the treasure? Wow. I've got my eyes on a bigger prize. I want Carlos. I don't care about gold doubloons. I want Carlos's head. I don't have time for the pirate's treasure. Ah, drat. The chest won't open. That's fine. Editor, make that in chronological order. It's a fun puzzle for you. Oh, it's a, it's a maze crap. Tomb of the Giants. Do we need a golden claw for this burrow? This is where I came in. Okay, not that way. I came in that direction. Let's go this way. Is it a big circle? This cuts through the middle, probably. Oh, here we go. <gasps> the ancient ladder of the pirate captain. I should have known. Bum, 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 bum. Is this where I... No, this is new. Oh, it's new, all right. Carlos's men are here. They got here before me, again. They're always one step ahead. My gun does nothing. I gotta go for those crates. Whew, that was close. Uh, <laughs> um, Pierce's grapple is a little bit stuck. Hang on, we'll, we'll deal with that in a second. We gotta kill Carlos's men first. They're too deadly. Get a good shot of his face. Might he turn around? Don't turn around. There we go. No, stop stop turning around. Come on, man. Just just look that way. There you go. No, no, not cover. Actually, if he's in cover, I can do this. There we go. At long last. At long last, I've found it. At long last, I've found it. You know, I can't say this. At long last, I've found it. The hidden pirate island. At long last, I've found it. The hidden island of the pirate king. My whole life, I've felt drawn to this zone. My whole life, I felt something was pulling me towards this island, but I never could figure out what. Until now. Eh. Eh. Not great. Okay, here, here, here's the assignment. Assignment for the chat. Think of something good to do with this rare and unique grappling hook glitch while I go refill my water bottle. Fix it in post. Now, we're, we're going to fix it right now, but you're, you're going to fix it. I'm not going to fix it. Got about 30 seconds, so. Brainstorm. Brain rave, as Ray William Johnson says.
All right, class, what do we got? It feels like I'm just too close to love you. And it feels like I am grapple hooked to a post. And now I know why these bungee jumping tickets were so cheap. Looks like Carlos was pulling my strings the whole time. That's not bad. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Looks like Carlos was pulling the strings. What is the string attached to even? I think it's attached to the ladder. The ladders have messed it up. The newly born Nathan Drake clone struggles to free himself from his grappling hook umbilical cord. That's pretty good. And here we see one of the true beauties of nature. And here we see one of nature's natural wonders, a newly born Nathan Drake clone. A newly born Nathan, hang on. And here we see one of nature's natural wonders, a newly born Nathan Drake clone, desperately trying, a newly born Nathan Drake, a newly born Nathan Drake clone. It's hard to say Drake clone. It's two, it's two, it's two consonants right next to each other. It's a bit of an issue for a non-professional voice actor like me. And here we see a newly born Nathan Drake clone trying desperately to free himself from his grappling hook umbilical cord. If he can't cut himself loose. If he can't cut himself loose before sundown. He will no doubt, he will no doubt be eaten by predators. And he will never get a chance to climb and he will never get the chance to climb brightly covered, covered? Brightly colored wooden planks, wooden planks. Climb, climb cliff faces with white paint on them, there you go. And he will never get the chance. And he will never get the chance to climb cliff faces with white paint on them. And he will never get the chance to climb, and he will never get the chance to climb cliff faces with white paint on them. There we go. Haha, ha, we did it. We did it, chat. Actually, just Greg did it by himself. But we did it, chat. Yay. Huzzah. You die. Problem solved. No, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying this is bad. I'm just trying to make a funny joke for my YouTube video. Oh my god, there's more. I spawned more. <laughs> I made more of them. It's been sounding like a role player with a bad stutter. That's how most of my streams sound. The part of the documentary where Carlos has been eat the baby Drake makes me so sad every time. Truly. Looks like Mitch back on the menu, boys. That's what Carlos, Carlos's men are orcs, what they sound like. Do I jump to that? I feel like I do. I'm going for it. Nope. Nope, that was incorrect. Eh, there, no, there's, there's a thing down there. Maybe I gotta hit the... There's probably a lever I gotta hit or a valve. Orcs, you mean zombies? Yeah, sorry, my bad. Well, they don't know. Where's the last one? There's one more. There's one more Carlos man somewhere. Where the heck is he? Hello, Carlos's man. Where are you now? I'm taking damage, dude. Where is this guy? Oh, there he is. Give me the sniper. Let's see. I feel like this is the right way, although maybe it's not. You probably gotta like take these islands. That thing is tempting. 
Probably just around the corner, right? Is there a way to drop down from here? No. Can I jump to that island? Probably not. It's kind of far. There is a bridge, though. Is this the right way? Maybe, but it's the bad way. The yellow Carlos man has accepted his fate. The bald one still persists. Oh, here's a grapple point. Here we go. Here we go. My favorite mechanic. Oh, Ooh, yeah. I'm coming for you, Calico. Everyone's heard of the famous Mansa Musa, but nobody knows his treasure was secretly in Calico's tomb. Crap. Calico is a lesser known character in history. No, mostly for his role in Bad End. The guy's jumping. Carlos's men, though. Carlos man down. Sniper rifle obtained. Grapple hook equipped. Grapple tossed. Oh, he was ready for it. You see that? He came right out of the grapple ready to punch. Ready to throw hands. I respect it. Is that hitting him? I got him that time, I think. My favorite part of Dragon Roost Island is Calico's Tomb. Oh, we fell down the cliff. Nice. That guy just jumped off the cliff. Okay. He just dive bobbed into the water. He just dove into the water. He just cannonballed into the water. That's one way to kill Carlos's men. That's one way to kill Carlos's men. He can't beat that quick scope. I know he knows he's doomed. That, that's a loud bird. Where's that bird at? I'm gonna kill that bird. He's too loud. Yeah, I'll give you um, I'll give you a thumbs up on Steam when I'm done playing this one. the ancient circular hut. Are Carlos's men in there? Hang on, this looks like a prime Carlos's men location. I don't see any. Oh, puzzle? Another, oh. Yes, cutscene, yes. Yes. Oh, just a ladder? He's not gonna, he's not gonna steal any more maps from people? What a thrill. What a thrill. Weeping angels. Oh no, is it gonna be from Doctor Who? <laughs> the ancient pirates by Tic Tac Toe. Oh, that's great. That's great. Wow, so many ancient carvings in the pirate's tomb. Like uh, that, what is that? And also they played a few rounds of Tic Tac Toe. Yep, here's your problem. Buildings facing <laughs> Carlos's men infestation. Wow, check out these ancient carvings inside the Pirate King's temple. So many strange symbols, like a conch cell, a couple of <laughs> games of tic-tac-toe, a frowny face from the X player. He lost three times in a row. There we go, there's, there's the framing to zoom in on for that one. Are Carlos's men gonna be in here too? How'd they get in here? There was a gate. Wow, a glorious tomb for a pirate. It actually is gonna be weeping angels, huh, no. 
Don't do this. Huh. Huh. Dr. Protean. Dr. Protean's a superior character for sure. Demons or angels guarding this tomb? Looks like both. I need to get the angels closer to the tomb. Okay. Seems easy enough. Just gotta find the initial jumping point. Where will it all begin? Ooh, yeah, the lens flare on the torch. Look at that. Oh, here we go. I found it. <laughs> Big tube market back in the day. Mm -hmm. A lot of you youngsters won't remember. This is how funeral services used to look back in the day. Is this not? Oh, there's got to be a box probably, right? Or a barrel. Oh, yeah, there's the box. All right, Amazon joke, maybe? Tombs are just a fad. Yeah, elaborate puzzle tombs are a fad. Give me a good old-fashioned gravestone any day. Ooh, another day pushing down crates at Amazon. Eh, I didn't think of one in time. Oh boy, here we go. Whoop. I prefer crypts, eh. Those tend to have necro dancers in them though. Left control to hold on to a ladder. Okay. Oh, they got a wacky tube. Let me in the slide. I want to slide down. Oh, it's not hollow. Dang it, it's the pillar. I thought it was a fun tube from McDonald's play place. Get out of here, Angel. I assume, I assume that counts as moving him closer. So that one's done. Amazon can't even afford wheels. Gotta drag this box in the ground. New cafe man just dropped? Okay, good. I was wondering. He hadn't posted yet. Burial map for me. You can't argue with classics. It's true. That is a classic. Hmm. Can I make that jump? I don't think so. I think the ladder is the only way back down. I think that's why I said left control to use ladder. I want to be careful because I'm assuming that if I die, I have to do every statue again. There we go. Can you jump to that? Hmm. How does he jump back? It's time I jumped back. It's time I jump back. Hmm. Maybe I stay up there. Oh boy. Oh, he's alive. Okay, good. He didn't die instantly. That's good. That's good. Um, let's go over here, maybe. There's something over here. Is this going to have a stairway in it, or is this going to be empty? It looks like stairs. Yeah, there we go. We got stairs. We got a stairway. Oh, yeah. The stairs took me... Hmm, I see, I see. All right, here we go. There we go. Alright. Is this the same tube I already got? Okay, it's a different tube. 
tubes are different. Oh, there's one. That one's down lower. Okay, I can get to that one somehow. This is one of the higher up angels. I asked too. There's a box down there that I probably use for one of the other ones. Is there any platforming to do? I don't think so. I think I just go back down. Carefully. Very carefully. I'm assuming I can uh, just drop off this, like the last one. There is a, oh, a pillar. Okay, the pillar probably helps the fall. Gotta land on that. There we go. Back down. Why I gotta come down to earth? Okay, I got that one. So I just need these two. His ladder, that's an easy one. His ladder's right there. Let me just grab the Amazon package and bring it over here. Stupid Jeff Bezos can't even afford wheels for the box. I gotta scrape it along the floor. Perfect. Now climb, ascend. <laughs> no PE breaks for complainers. I heard you weren't a team player. All right, one more. Only one more demon must be foretold. Be right, careful, careful. There we go, nice and easy. Now how to get to the last one is the question. Go, go spend some time in the meditation box, yeah. Go you go use your seven minute break in the meditation cube. Alright, last one. Ramirez, last puzzle, make it count. How do we get up there? Is there another stairway inside this little circular wizard tower, maybe? Stairway to heaven? Stairway to heaven? Stairway to heaven? Nope. Hmm. Is that, that one goes that way. I don't think... Oh, those, are those grapple points? Is that two grapple points? I don't know. Two? I don't know if I can chain them. Do I got to chain grapples up here? That's going to go very poorly. That's not going to be good. <laughs> Amazon uses the on program system. <laughs> They're known for electrocuting the occasional worker. Okay, I think I had to do a chain grapple. Oh god. Can you can you can you save? You can save. Okay, good. Save. I hit save like 10 times. Hopefully that saves. Well, here goes nothing. Oh, it's just one. Okay, good. It's one for each. It's, it's one for forward and one for back. Not two at the same time. That's better. I can't believe I got in tune with Jeff Bezos. I can't believe I got entombed with Jeff Bezos inside his giant crypt just so I can move his boxes around for all eternity. This is total bullcrap, man. This is total bullcrap, man. We need a union. It wasn't so hard. According to this map, the treasure should be in Egypt. What other countries are there? Egypt, yes. Let's go, fourth country confirmed. The continent of Africa is henceforth known as Egypt. Damn. <laughs> that was very unfortunate for him. 
He should have known that driving the car through sand wouldn't go so well. What did he expect driving the car through sand, honestly? You gotta take those on the road, dude. You need a road for cars to work. Lost treasure. Hang on. If you take a screenshot, if you screenshot this, then go into Photoshop and get rid of the guy, then go into Photoshop and get rid of the guy, editor, I'll do that. It makes for a pretty good wallpaper. It makes for a pretty good wallpaper. All right, we're good. Oasis have always looked romantic to me. Oh, there's the Oasis. Oh no, Carlos's men might be there. Don't get fooled. Don't get fooled by the Oasis. They're always a mirage. So that's why two-day delivery isn't a thing anymore. Mm-hmm. Ah, yes, the Oasis. Perfect. I'll absorb the moisture into my jeans. I'll wring them out whenever I'm thirsty. Bless the Carlos and his men. <laughs> Only water for miles. Better wash my shoes in it. There it is, the ancient city. The city of the forgotten past. My God tells me the treasure is here. It better be. The car's broken. I hope there are no more clues. The treasure better be like a camel. The treasure better be a way out of the desert. Otherwise, he's screwed. He's got no chance to escape. What will he do? I'm finally here. No, you're still kind of far away. Nah, it's a little further away. You still got to sprint through sand for a solid 45 seconds. Don't get too ahead of yourself now. I've always liked old structures. Only Carlos's men are allowed to be ahead of you. Only Carlos's men are allowed to be one step ahead of you. All right, here we go. Egyptian puzzle, right? In the tomb of the kings. Oh, axes on the wall. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Ready? Uncharted. 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 Perfect. I bet there are hidden traps. I'm too good, dude. Carlos is the treasure. True. Hidden traps, eh? Yep. I bet there are hidden traps. <laughs> you could say that. Yeah, you know what? I bet there are hidden traps. I think you're on to something there. Okay, what's the gimmick here? The the Anubis says this way looks pretty good. The Anubis likes this way. Can I just like jump across it jankily? No. If one is activated, you die. That freaking hurts! That there are hidden traps. Trial and error. Okay, only facing forward creatures. Oh, Anubis is only. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Only Anubises are safe. Because Anubis was facing forward previously. That's the gimmick. Anubis. No more hidden traps for me. I prefer traps I can see with my own two eyes. These sands are yellow. They bear the curse of many years. Hidden traps in here? More axes, maybe? More axes and allies? I bet there are hidden traps. Uh oh, not again. Now let's see. Looks like a dead end. Have to have the classic dart trap? Yeah, I'm looking out for that one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Oh no, poles. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, not poles. My only weakness. How did the ancient pharaoh know? Oh, you can see him on the roof, okay. How did the pharaoh know my least favorite battlefront map was Polis Massa? All right, here we go. This is safe. I bet there are hidden traps. I bet there are hidden traps. Ancient Egyptian trash compactor. Oh my god. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> here we go. Okay, let's, let's memorize it. Let's memorize it. Let's, let's solve it from the vantage point before we go in. Okay, it's left. So not left. It's, it's right. It's, um... Left, right, left, right, left. Hmm. I can't see the ending from here. Okay, it's left. Careful, the obvious path might have hidden traps, Drew. Okay, you, you go in, it's left, left, right, then right, left, right, it's left, right, right, left, right, right, left, 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 right, right, left, left, left. Okay, it's, it's left, right, right, then you spam lefts. I think I got it. First one, left, left, right. Wait, I'm already lost crap. <laughs> oh no. Oh, here it is, this, this is the way I was trying to go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, the maze is pretty easy. I figured out the maze, no problem. Right? I think I got it. Pretty sure I got it. Oh, I'm, on, I'm on the extreme edge. You don't want to be on the extreme edge, crap. I might not have it. Let's see. Oh, no, I did it. Okay. Okay, that maze was not too bad. The treasure of Mansa Musa. I finally made it. Mm. Fuck. <laughs> Poor bad end, man. Bad end cannot catch a break. The big reveal is that Carlos is Hitman. I can't believe that Carlos was Hitman the whole time. To be continued. Oh, no. I gotta know what happens to Carlos. I gotta get my revenge on Carlos. I never did get my revenge on Carlos. <laughs> I don't want to shoot you. Mm -hmm. I want one more, one more insert real quick. All right, solve the maze. Not too hard. What's my reward for solving the maze? Editor put that when I saw the maze. Well, there you go. That was the game Bad End by Monty Games. This is how my story ends. Pretty good. Pretty solid experience. Let's go give it the old like, favor, subscribe. It did, it did have a bad ending. Hey, oh. All right, store page. Nominate game for an award. Let's see. Bad end is a game where 
Hang on, bad end is a game where you have to fight a lot of Carlos's men. They are everywhere in this game. The game has good graphics, though, and when your guy dies, it it <laughs> it 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 is very funny. I recommend the game. There we go. Post review. Ta da. This came out in 2022. Yeah, it sure did. Let's see the other game. There, Here's Commando Hero. Okay, here's the upcoming Commando Hero. Does Commando Hero have a trailer yet? Oh, is it like an obstacle course game? Is it like a, like a parkour running game? Is it like Wipeout? Looks like Wipeout. Hero who wants to be a commando has to pass difficult tracks. Do push-ups if you lose. How about Neo Dash? Is Neo Dash good? Oh, Neo Dash looks pretty good. Dubstep. The match three section was unexpected. Now it was it was pretty expected for an Uncharted clone, honestly. Need for Speed Unbound sixty two what sixty two dollars? The heck? Is this new? Did this come out? Is this recent? There's no reviews. Oh, it comes out December. Okay. Oh, this is probably copyrighted crap. Copyrighted music. Thanks, EA. Thanks for copyright striking my broadcast. Destiny 2, Witch Queen. Whoa. Dude. F1. Whoa. Maze, need more Minotaur? That's true. If the Maze had a Minotaur, that would have been pretty good. That would have been a good ending. Good ending battle. Battlefield Escalation. <laughs> They're not going to escalate their sales. Am I right? What's that new game? There's there's a new cowboy game that looks pretty good. Evil West. It's fifty bucks. Oh my god, I gotta see if I can I gotta try to get an Evil West key. Cause I kinda wanna play Evil West. Just behind you. But I don't wanna pay fifty bucks for it. It's kind of a lot for Evil West. Reviews for Evil West have been very polarizing. Is it on Game Pass? Oh you know what? It probably I think it is on Game Pass. I think it is on Game Pass. Because reviews for Evil West is either like, this game is a Xbox 360 game released in 2022, therefore it sucks, or they're like, this game is an Xbox 360 game released in modern era. It's good to throw back to the old style of game. So it depends on if you like 360 third-person shooters, which I do. I'm a bit of a fan. Not a fan of Plague Tale, though, or Requiem. I probably won't be playing either of those games. Evil West fans when the good East fans walk in. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. But yeah, I'm pretty sure Evil West is on Game Pass. So that's good. I can play that. Story Rich. Why is Modern Warfare 2 in Story Rich? Excuse me? Excuse me? I saw Modern Warfare 2 in there. That can't be. That that can't be. Yeah, so there's popular story games, Um, you know. There's some good story games like Spider-Man, Gotham, Spider-Man, God of War, Red Dead. You know, Red, Red Dead's an okay story game. Cyberpunk's a decent story game, I guess. Persona, eh. I, I can go either way on Persona. That, one, that one's whatever. But Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, that, that's a story game. Now, that game's got a good story. It does, it does have dialogue options. That's true. Gotta play Ready or Not. Yeah, I want to play Ready or Not. Oh, yeah, Sonic. There's a new Sonic. I forgot about that one. Product removal announcement. Uh-oh. We have received lots of feedback from our player base saying they cannot play the game properly with older Windows version to protect our players' rights. We've removed the purchase option. What? For what game? Now now I want to know what game this is. Nobody the turnaround. The heck is this? Starts in a galaxy not so far away. Oh, Star Wars. Hang on. This could be good. It's all about here. 
And now. Is it a telltale? Right around the corner. Is it choice? Oh, it's not choices matter. Dang it. Behold, a world unfolds it's I am alive. as pretty and ugly as your real one. Populated with people you feel familiar, but don't really know. They are the nameless multitude. It's a depression simulator. Oh, the cool. That I love being depressed. World. It's an Amazon warehouse simulator. Rediscover real life through a different pair of eyes. Do away with things taken for granted. It actually Feel is an Amazon simulator. Struggle of lives. Experienced in so many perspectives. I played the demo for this. Is we it good? Are the nobodies, and we are equal. Is any good? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> the character's name is Sorry Ass? This is like in the developer's trailer. I, I would expect a streamer to name their character Sorry Ass, but in the trailer for the game, the devs named their guy Sorry Ass. That's hilarious. Brick Mover. Play Ring Toss. Is this Shenmue? Are we watching Shenmue right now? Finally, I don't have to go outside to be sad. 2022 Fall. Is that Watch Dogs guy? Looks like Watch Dogs guy. Alright, what are the reviews for this one? What are the reviews like? Game's graphics are nice. Price tag is appropriate. I sang the alphabet, woke up a friend to help me with math equation, drew a triangle, and passed the test with 100%. Played the demo three times. Oh, it's got a demo. Got a demo? Oh, no, they, they removed it, though, because it's not launching on some PCs. Hang on, I want to play the demo for that one. I want to I play the demo of being depressed. I don't know if I want to commit to the full purchase, though, of being depressed. I should buy Squad. I should buy Titanfall. Why am I just looking at Steam sales? Why look at Steam sales when there's a much more pressing matter? Close your eyes and cover your ears, because it's time for another episode of The Tester. <laughs> if only Bad End was longer. Oh, poor Ninja. I can't believe Ninja was eliminated. That's total bullcrap. My name is Ducious Maximus. My name is Baby Tooth, because I have a Baby Tooth. I'm sorry, I just lost my breath. you gave the best performance by far. Hang on, turn the volume up. Crank the volume on this one. J Tight, your character that was pretty underdeveloped. I don't really have the option to give a second chances. Your game is here. Ninja, you came out as the weakest player on a strong team. Your game also wins here. Selected from thousands of applicants. Dedicated gamers match. I miss Tales from the Hard Drive. Is it hang on, there might be a new one to Tales from the Hard Drive. I haven't checked in a while. Hang on. Let me get let me get a new tab open over here on monitor number two. That's right, this is an advanced operation. I'll search for a new Tales from the Hard Drive. I don't think there is one though. Everyone's emotional because J-Tight and Ninja went home. I'm just so shocked and upset and really taken aback by another double elimination. Like, both of those boys, they busted their ass. Challenge after challenge. The both Because they're so deserving to be here. It feels a lot different than the house. It feels really empty. I'm starting to realize that, you know, like, I really do want this. You know, like, at first, I didn't even think I was going to okay, get this Okay, there is a new one. Crap. We lost there, there's no new Tales from the Hard Drive. Sorry, we're stuck with this. We're stuck with the tester. Hey, Good morning, gamers. They say talk is cheap, but in the gaming world, a simple miscommunication can cost you big. So today, you'll fight a war of words from your lips to the gods' ears. Break into teams of two and get dressed in the wardrobe provided. Oh, what does that mean? Get your lips to the gods' ears. To the gods. Oh, they gotta dress as Kratos. Kratos smash. It's gotta work time. Gotta be. Everybody, man, Kratos is amazing. He's vicious. He's ruthless. Okay, contestants. For today's challenge, you'll be cremating the body of your dead family, who we have pre-killed for you. 
Go ahead and rub those onto your skin to truly cosplay as Kratos. You will be destroyed if a muscle gets you. Let's do it. Oh yeah, that's crazy. Oh, oh man. God. We see nothing but togas. We're thinking, you know, it can't possibly be a physical challenge because how often do you see people in togas doing anything physical? Yeah, first of all, what are the teams? Me, Diddy? Yeah, I mean, I'm excited to pick that. Uh, uh, Maybe uh, me. No, 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 I got no complaints. It's already apparent who the teams are going to be. We have Achilles and Diddy. They're really close friends, so that's a natural team. Relax. Quadra Monster and Christy, they're very close with each other. That's another natural team. I'm a goddess. I feel awesome. And because of my alliance with Suskaiden, she immediately knows she's going to be working with me, although I kind of go into it grudgingly. I'm not wearing like a pocket pants. I sort of equate Suskaiden to be sort of like a tornado. She gets too close, you kind of get stuck into her bullshit. I hope you don't see my yeah, well, they already seen that. I hope they like it. Boreality bears the right of it. Do you think that they agreed like to You're put like that in a documentary? Yeah. What is going on here? Was, was, was the cameraman like, oh, no, no this, this, this will be cut out. This is B-roll. Don't worry. This won't be in there. We won't make this the thumbnail for the video. The final challenge is throw yourself, yourself off a Jesus. cliff. No, she did it for me. Oh, I was like, oh. Like, 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 crazy shit. Like, what are we going to be doing? With how the challenges have been going, we have no idea what to expect. I look out the window and I see a beach front, I see water, and then I realize, like, oh my god, we're in Santa Monica. And so I was just like praying, I was like, please let me be on the beach, please let me be on the beach. Welcome to beautiful Santa Monica, California. Only one of you will earn the coveted position of production associate at world famous Santa Monica Studio, which is only a stone's and throw Tendis away Frisbee from is not a fan of this. Backyard, huh? But first, you'll have to survive our colossal God of War inspired challenge. <laughs> it's just three strings. Joining us as always is Mr. Brent Goki, Senior Release Manager, Global First Party Quality Assurance. And our very own gamer goddess, Adrian Curry. And our guest panelist today is a man who began his career in the gaming industry as a tester. He's uh -oh. one of the creative directors at Santa Monica Studio and was the design director on God of War 3. He looks We've pissed. Hi guys, welcome. So obviously, you guys have been working with our he looks team. Pissed, looking for man. So, do your best. Word. Now on to today's challenge. To be successful in the gaming industry, you must be a fast and efficient communicator. Someone who can transmit clear messages quickly and effectively and also receive and decode. One team at a time, we'll each take a spot on opposite sides of that partition attached by a rope leash. On both sides of the field are scattered a variety of God of War inspired objects. Each team member a must plate? their side of the beach and find objects Is a plate a God of War inspired in object? Simple enough, right? Of course not, because both team members will be aligned. What? I oh no, just like Kratos. I'm completely on my side. Me and Christy are really good with communicating, but I already know that I'm going to be a little bit at a disadvantage because I can't see. The team that both team members will have both thumbsticks pressed in and their eyes gathered. Now, like matches, Zeus. Was that Zeus? It was someone in God of War. Are not automatically safe from elimination. Instead, they will go where few mortals have gone before. Behind the scenes of Santa Monica Studio with Todd Pappy to sample an unreleased <laughs> game still in the development process. Hang on. You did Todd Pappy does not. They only have one shot of Todd Pappy. That's the only shot they have is that shot right there. Did they, they forget to film Todd Pappy? Instead, they will go where few mortals have gone before. Behind the scenes of Santa Monica Studio with Todd Pappy. He looks so upset. To sample an unreleased game still in the development process. Whoever wins this challenge today gets a trip inside the studio where we could be working. If this isn't the best prize ever, I mean, I don't know what is. I gotta get it. You'll get a chance to impress your future coworkers, which is extremely important because Todd and his coworkers will choose one gamer. He looks to be so safe angry. Tonight. The losers will face the panel, and someone will go home tonight. So let the games begin. Ah! Achilles, Scott, Diddy, you two are up first. Sticks are extremely high, but um, me and part of Diddy think we're gonna go in here and you guys again. I'm confident, so you know it's, we're gonna do it. Achilles, Scott, Diddy, ready? Go. All right, cool, let's go. So the challenge start, man. I got long arms, long legs, so I just try to find anything I feel different from the sand. So wait, what? What is the challenge? Just carry that one, right? Just carry that one. I have something. Hey, I got the basket. I got the basket. I got the basket. Go back. Let's go back. What is the challenge? Oh, they have to match them up. Okay. So why does why does being attached by a rope matter? The, the rope seems like it's got a lot of slack. <laughs> I'd be angry too. I'd be really pissed. I would be pretty mad. That's true. He looks like he's not in two XP. I'm thinking five matches in four minutes of what we just went through. It's not gonna be easy. The level of communication that me and Sky Diddy displayed was damn near flawless. The other teams are in trouble. Quadra Monster, Christy Pride, are you ready? Go! Uh -oh. I've been on the winning team like every single time. I've seen that if you just make one little mistake, like you're gone. So definitely this time, like, I'm not gonna make any mistakes, and I'm definitely gonna give 200% of the time. Uh, I got a, a twiggy thingy. I'm pretty sure I have a frisbee like object. I found the twig, and then I keep going around a little bit because I want to be efficient, and I don't want to miss anything. I found a frisbee, still only got one thing right now. Okay, I have something that feels like a skull. I'm just sweeping everywhere, kind of feeling around. Every time I'm finding an object, I'm describing it. It's soft. It feels like a bottle, like a whale or something. I found a wicker basket type object. I found a bottle, like a plastic bottle. Okay, what? what no, 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 I don't have anything right now. Nothing. Nothing. I'm like, Quasha, how can you have nothing? How fast are you going? Are you in the middle already? I'm going all over. Chris is oh, already no. finding like, all these items, and I don't have a twig. Are you crawling? I'm starting to freak out a little bit because I'm like, oh my god, I have. The rope keeps him in the circle. Oh, okay, gotcha. Okay, come in. Go. That's a match. Okay, what else you got? Frisbee? I don't know. I have nothing but a stick. I don't even know if it's part of it. I think I have a stick too. Put the stick down. Back. That is not a match. Okay, that's a trident. That's not a stick. I'm really freaking out because three minutes and thirty seconds have already gone by. You know, I'm scrambling through the sand just trying to find anything. They're doing oh, terrible. Right, right, they they will I'm not be touring to Sony nothing. Santa Monica. Oh, okay, come back, come back, come back. Five, four, three, prison two. That's a match. That time. <sighs> Quaja and Christy Pride, you have two matches. I thought they were gonna be small. I didn't die. I'm gonna run around. Sucks that I was trying to be so careful when in this challenge. I really didn't have to be that careful. There's just big shit lying around everywhere. She's got in. Reality pass. You ready? Yes. Go. Hey. Go. Let me take a look at that. Ready? Close to the time. They need what, like two to win. Something. Something else. This is not what I expected. We're watching the tester. I got to see who's going to win the job at Sony Santa Monica Studios. Bring the disc back, bring the disc back. Match, match. It's very important. Two matches so fast. This is awesome. 
Match. That's a match. You got the hammer? Yeah, let me look right. Yeah, hammer. Match. match. That's a match. Okay, I've got a water bottle and a strap. Look for those. I just feel like four is not enough, so I just keep going for more objects. I put a bottle of water. It's a bottle of water. And I put the bottle of water on top of the table. I have my hand over there waiting for him to do the same. Hold on, I got that. I got that. I had it. I recall putting it underneath the table. And I'm just uh -oh. underneath the table looking everywhere I can. I feel absolutely nothing but sand. 30 seconds. Come on, reality. Come on. Out. 30 seconds. He's going to put it there. Then. This has been 10 seconds. Reality, where's the bottle? Where, where's the bottle? I have no idea. Where's the bottle, reality? We have no time, and I have absolutely lost track of this bottle. Five. Come on, four, bottle. Three. Ah, it's not making sense. Where's the bottle? Two. One. Dun, nine. dun, dun. I mean, it's not really that tense because they already, they won. It's the most demoralizing experience ever. I had the bottle on the table the whole time. Just in the but chaos the, 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 the second team the lost, though, so who cares? My fault. I can't believe him. He said he had it. If, if y'all were editing this one, you, you put this one in the middle, right? Because the first team, the second, the first team had five. The second team had like two, and the third team had four. So you, you make it go five, four, two. You don't, you don't put the obvious losers in the middle. You, you like to make this have any tension at all. You got to put it in the middle, not the end, when you already know the result. It's gonna cost us so freaking much. Okay, gamers, you all had four minutes to find as many matches as possible. Oh, it's not done. Chrissy Pride, your team had two matches, so it really came down to two teams. So with five matches, the winner is Achilles and Sky Diddy. <laughs> This is about the hair of our chin chins, but uh, me and Sky Diddy are going to Santa Monica Studios, and I can't be happier. Achilles and Sky Diddy, it will be up to you to stand out because they will decide which of you will be safe from elimination tonight. But uh -oh. here is the tester twist. You must choose one of your competitors to accompany you to Santa Monica Studio. Remember, whomever you choose will also get the opportunity to earn individual immunity by impressing Todd and his team. So let's give each of them a moment <laughs> Good to luck. Case as a Good luck. You Good luck impressing awesome Todd. Reality pay, that's not going to happen. You. Man lock. Come on, three guys or three girls. There's, There's no way they're impressing uh, Todd. He, that's not possible. I mean, this is the opportunity to go in there and wow your, your future employer. I mean, guy code? That's not going to work on me. I'm a lot deeper than that. Sue Skyden? Man, um, I think I did my best. I want to go there because if I get to talk to these people, I got the job. This was the best prize by far. It would mean the most to me. And I think they know I know my shit about video games. And they know that I'm for real. So I've been on the, like, the winning team for like every challenge. It's just an amazing opportunity. Opposite right order? Yeah, maybe Achilles, opposite Sky order would work better, too. Talk amongst yourselves. Decide which competitor you will take with you. Right. Either way, just don't put that one last. <sighs> okay, Achilles, Sky Diddy, I need your answer, boys. I'm going to be Christy. Shut oh my god. Get the yeah, get yeah, right. me. All I can do is just cry and hug the shit out of them. Sky Diddy, Achilles, Christy Pry, a private If you met Tom O, do you say I'd say I'm a big fan you of your games, Tom Howard. Just like, like that. I'll do like a Squidward like voice. I want. You can keep the stuff. That's all I want. One of you will be safe, and the rest of you will face the panel. I'll see you all at elimination. The walk of shame. Pretty frustrated. I, I wasn't even her fault, it was mine. I definitely blew it. Uh that means tonight I'm probably up quite possibly up for elimination, which is kind of a bummer. It is kind of a bummer. The prize for this challenge is the winners get to go to Santa Monica Studio. Going. And Achilles and Scotty picked me to go to Santa Monica with them. Here badges. Let's go. It's just like paradise. And then you see the crew, and I mean, it's just it's awesome. So, welcome. Let me introduce you to some of the team. So, right here, we got <laughs> Simon. He's our lead designer. Chris O'Neill, senior level designer. We got Vince. He is combat designer. Got yeah, Paul, Vince. Lead combat designer. I get to meet some of the people that are hands on, like, birth of these games. And it's Hi, fantastic. guys. Hey, hey handshake. <laughs> yeah. I think there's only been five people before you guys. So, these are focus testers. We got a chance to play a secret game unreleased that the world ain't even experienced yet, man. Okay, okay. Oh, my God. Right, the game, whole, the whole office is empty now. It's unfathomable. When I get back to the loft, I just had that feeling that I was going home, so I, I packed my stuff. Chrissy's not there, so... <laughs> listen, listen to the... Hang on. Hang on. Normal speed. Normal speed. Listen to the fake Johnny Cash hurt they got for this. Listen to the song they play. When I get back to the loft, <laughs> I just I had that feeling that I was going shoes. home, so I, I packed my stuff. Today. Chrissy's not there, so... You know, That's I feel great. a little bit alone at this so point. So sad. So I emotional. Might be a double elimination tonight. Oh, man. When I get back to the loft, I'm undefeated. I feel abysmal, and I, I feel that I'm going home tonight. Hey, how you doing? Mm. <laughs> wow, you're so sad. Reality fails. Reality is just been in his head all, and it's just melting my heart. So since Sackboy always makes me feel better, I figure it will make him feel better. Stop being so sad. He's trying to cheer you up. I've never wanted to rip a Sackboy's head off so badly in my entire life. I appreciate you trying to cheer me up, Sackboy, but I, I can't take it. Mm. <laughs> I would simply clip it to a table. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Game fantastic, man. Do an so IRL glitch. One of the first to experience a title. So basically, I'm gonna talk one on one, and then we'll switch you guys out. Really, we're gonna start with you. This is my chance to shine, to show them why you know I belong here. What do you think? This is awesome. Cool. What makes you think that you'll be a great addition to the team? I mean, I've been in the military years, and you know, when I'm not doing that, you know, this time I'm, I'm on the games. I got a clear vision, I'm innovative, and I'm still a well-rounded person. So, we're gonna call I know where covers should be played. Like. So, I think I sit down well uh, myself. You know, uh, I still Ninja, remember, uh, remember Ninja, his right, great so interview, when he down. said, I know where uh, cover should be <laughs> in games. He's different mindsets, man. <laughs> he knows where the cover man. should be so played. That was the best interview ever. What do you think that you bring to the team? I need to, I'm gonna like apply for a job at like a bank. And they're like, so why do you think you'd be a um good financial advisor? Why, why do you think you'd be good at our financial institution? Uh, I, when, I, when I play Gears of War, I have a lot of ideas for uh, where cover could be placed. I know where cover should go. Oh, I feel, it's a uh, great interview I feel answer. Everybody dreaming up in the world, got a lot of ideas, brain like that. That's why I feel I have a lot of creativity in my brain. I feel like a share. We all got a different brain, and they can work with me and unlocking a special kind of creativity that I have in me. Where do you want to go in the future? Do you want to be a designer, environment artist? A design artist. Can you draw? 
Hey, my brain. Not too much. <laughs> That's a good idea, man. You gotta work on that then. <laughs> Thank you for your time. We wish you best of luck. I'm a little intimidated, you know, when I was talking to him, but hopefully he liked my energy and I can bring the table, you know, interesting. Hey, Kristen. Hey, Dan. So they're, they're, they're interviewing for a QA job. So that guy's like, I want to make my own game. No, 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 no. You gotta be like, I'm willing to come in 80 hours a week and play crappy God of War. So I'm meeting a bunch of That's what you gotta numbers. say. What would you want to do here? Um, you know, I'm a writer. I like to write and I draw here and there. There's one thing that's critical to storytelling. Just one thing. What is that thing? The characters and character relations, I feel, are important. Like, all the I graphics. Wrong so answer. It was the it. graphics. The, the graphics are the most okay, important. Thank you. Sure, thank you. It was a real interview, and I was nervous. And they also interviewed Scotty and Achilles, which makes me a little nervous because they get to grant one of us immunity for this elimination, and my team did do the worst. All right, guys. Thank you guys for coming. Hats off to you two for winning the challenge. I know that you guys have elimination tonight, so we're going to send you back to Loft. We wish you best of luck. Oh, man. Coming in here and just the feel of this place. That's the first time he's ever smiled. The first time he ever smiled is when they're leaving his office. He's like, we're going to send you back to the Loft. Smile. He's so happy to be <laughs> to be done with this crap. Hey guys, bad ass, bad ass. It was great. It really wasn't that great. Honestly, like they were. Like I know it was awesome. They were like, it was awesome. I don't know if I want to hear this or not. I'm completely. Tell me more about this cover. I was pretty jealous. I think I lost out. Not just as. Well, when the when the broomac is chasing you, it'd be fun if there was some cover the broomac couldn't destroy. Serious man, I packed all my shit already. Ready to go. You need to keep it took three shots for the broom act to destroy the cover that way. You can hide there for a little bit, but you're forced to be on the move. I feel pretty nervous going into elimination. You're forced to fully utilize the roadie one. You know, I deserve to be here. I do not feel good about elimination at all. Up until this point, I've been pretty successful. Today definitely sent me back a lot, and I just gotta defend myself. Good evening, gamers. Good evening. Today's challenge tested your ability to communicate effectively. Achilles and Sky Diddy proved they have a way with words. The two of you chose Christy Pride to join you at Santa Monica Studio. Whoever impressed them the most earns immunity for tonight, and will be safe from elimination. That's your top decision. First, it was a pleasure meeting all of you. I wish you best of luck in the future, no matter what. But one of you stood out and was mature, well-spoken, and answered every single question that we threw at you. So the person with immunity tonight is Achilles. <laughs> Achilles. Winning immunity today. It feels wonderful. If I lost every single challenge before, at Childs. Congratulations, Achilles. You are the only one. Good job, at Childs. The rest of you. Looks like the lie. interview uh, wasn't his Achilles. Achilles heel. Sky Diddy, I love your passion. Very enthusiastic. But I'm wondering, is that character? Are you like that all the time? Sky Diddy's a clown. When you're talking with corporates, they don't want to see you clowning. I'm concerned. You can't switch it off. Might wear thin. But hopefully, you do have that other side that just wants to work hard. Go to it. I know how to turn everything off. No, I need to. I'm wrong. I ain't gonna act stupid. I goofy everything. Two hours later, I gotta get the job done. This is my mission. I kind of want to move on to the team that almost won. Reality, what do you think of your guys' performance today? The blame is entirely on me uh, for my team. Absolutely, there's no doubt about it. And it would be a shame if I go home over some olive oil, that's for sure. One thing that I was extremely surprised by was when they were deciding who to pick to go to Santa Monica, you said, oh, pick me, guy code. Man lock, come on, three guys, there's three girls. That's how we split it up, even Steven. <laughs> I was extremely surprised. Uh-oh. I thought that was kind of childish. I think reality childish. is a juvenile for this. It doesn't seem like his heart is all there. Sexist gamer. That you want this job. Automatically, I think that, that's that a capital G gamer right there. Really Get that's him out of here. That's... Be he does not have here. what there it takes. Nothing I want more than to work at Santa Monica Studios. I really wish you would have said that. He does, he does not have what it takes to work in a diverse place like Santa Monica Studios. As we saw from the developers in Santa Monica Studios, that was white guy in 30s, white guy in 30s, white guy in 30s, white guy in 30s, and white guy in 40s. Santa Monica Studio is very diverse. There is no room for that there. I do too. Definitely another slip up of mine today. And to say something like that in front of Top Happy is embarrassing and unprofessional. Moving on to the team that lost. Quasi Monster, what do you think? Um, I definitely take the weight of um, that loss upon my shoulders. I did go in assuming that the items were a lot smaller than what they were. See, it's funny you mentioned the size, because I don't think the size was really an issue, because Christy's like, I have a basket, a frisbee. She's calling out things that are obviously bigger in size. When you really look at it just today, like, I really did screw up. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm bracing myself. Like, I don't want to go home. <laughs> Welcome but, aboard. But I will own up to the that fact was, that, that, was the, that was the gimmick. The first person to say a slur on camera is immediately welcomed into Sony. I'm kind of curious, you know, reality pales. Seems like that, 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 that's, that's for the Activision game show. Job, and maybe you're just here to win the competition and prize. That's for the EA and really Activision and Ubisoft. Ubisoft as well. Because, you know, it's getting to the point where we can't... We can't See, the Activision, the Activision reality show is if you say a slur, you win Activision. But the Ubisoft one is you have to, like... <laughs> you, you know. You know. You know what you know what I'm saying. I don't want to say it. I don't <laughs> you know, you understand what I'm saying. Yeah, you have to sexually harass a fellow employee to get into the Ubisoft game show. That's how you do that one. I'm back into a corner. I gotta fight my ass out. We gotta fight each other for this. It's time to get game faces on. I'm putting mine on now. Reality, if you were in our shoes, who would you eliminate then? I guess I had no choice but to say pleasure. Up until today, I've, I've proven myself pretty worthy, I think. We all got a passion while we're here. That's cool. I like each other. That's cool. It's about the friendship, though. What's critical for me? Honestly, if you would have said something more along the lines of what Tracy said, I would have picked you. Yeah, I agree. I don't know. Between his his mistake and the challenge costing them the win and the way he played his case, I'm thinking he might send reality home. He said it perfectly last night. Time to second chance is over. That was one shot to get in there and meet who you could be working with. More than one person asking for a second chance. Of course, of course. What do you think? Honestly, I would like to pick up people I know can beat me up. He knows the material. He's a great gamer. Of course, I want out of my house. Wait, come on. Why would you keep He's a great who gamer. Even though Skyden is really telling the judges she wants me to go home because she looks at me as a threat. It's actually a compliment. At this moment, I'm so grateful to Skyden. I, I appreciate you guys and all speaking up. We talked a lot before this elimination. I don't really think you know our opinions changed. Quaja, it sounds like you're popular in the house. It sounds like you're liked. But you're on the losing team. Uh, you performed the worst, and uh, I'm sorry. Your game is here. Eliminated. Don't, don't do it. I'm so Eliminate two honest. of them. I
I kind of actually exceeded my expectations here. Take down two of them again. Really of somebody... He knows his cover. That man knows his cover. As somebody who was <laughs> tough enough to be able to hold their own against such amazing people. <laughs> but I'm thankful that I got a chance to have He's a He's got a lot of great ideas for cover so much more confidence games. Myself, so much more self-worth that I made it this far. I can go home knowing that I am capable of so much more than I think I am. Congratulations. You're all still in the running for the job at Santa Monica Studio. The $5,000 signing bonus, the Sony 3D television, PlayStation 3, and the 2012 Ford Focus Titanium. But who's powered up? And who is running low on lives? Mm. This elimination was such a close call. Despite the judges telling us we have no more second chances, they gave me a second chance. And that means I'm on life support. From here on out, I gotta go big or go home. Tighten up the cover on floor, too. Mm -hmm. Next week on the tester. Oh, we, we want no spoilers. No spoilers for the tester. No spoilers. I don't want to know what's going to happen next. What's going to happen next is we're going to play Quicksort, by the way. We're going to do a round of Quicksort. Maybe we'll watch another tester after Quicksort. I don't know. Depends on how long Quicksort lasts. We do got to watch Caffeine Man as well. So let's rev up those fryers and start sorting some categories. Hopefully not chronologically. Hopefully different than chronological this time. I, I don't want to know what happens next on the tester either. How many, hang on, how many episodes are there of this? Oh, God. Okay, there, there's, there's eight total. I want, I, want to see, I want to see the bio of Ninja. Let's watch Ninja's bio before we go play Quick Sort. Metal Gear, Guilty Gear, and Xenogears. I'm a gearhead, that's just what it is. Goomba's a trooper, the king be the Cooper. Ludwig is like a smart kid in a stupor. Seven fantasies of final with my addicts, or why character with the roof. Then the plan. Alright, let's go play Quick Sort instead. I don't think, I don't think we need to see this. Join on Memorize in. J, G, X, L. Oh no, Wingo got there first. Okay, whatever you do, Wingo, do not start the game till I say so. As the first player to join, you, you, you get starting authority, but don't start it. Okay, don't touch anything till we're ready to go. So preferably we have a full team. Although last night we did a lot better without a full team. The full team was kind of a kind of a hazard, kind of a detriment. The more dedicated the player base. More of a chance you have to succeed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we'll get well, I, one more minute. Obo two is here as well. If you want to play, you have a minute to join starting now. What is this? It's a Jackbox Party Pack game. You can join in the fun by going to jackbox.tv and typing in J G X L. Then you too can play. Play along. I'm on mobile. You can do it on mobile. That's the cost of living on the side of the country with In and Out. I wish I had In and Out over here. I gotta fly over there and try some. It does work on mobile, though, by the way. All right, I'm going to say a few seconds left. It has been a minute. Is everybody here that wants to play? Is it okay? If you're in chat and you want to play and you're not in yet, say I in the next ten seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, well, J.K. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you, you can you can start it up. You can start it up, Wango. Let's do it. Yeah, remember, watch your screen. Don't watch the stream. The stream can lag. Watch your screen. Because when we when we get to the end game and we need blocks to be moved really fast, it's better if you're watching your screen well, instead of my stream. Because you can sure hit the arrow sooner here, to get it out of the middle. Important. 
This is Quicksort Forever, the mode where you can keep playing Quicksort to your Quicksort's content. Prompts will keep rolling in, but all your missorted blocks will remain. Don't let them build up. <laughs> World Series victories. Oh no. From least victories. I should, but I don't. Most victories. I should know it, but I don't know it. It's least, it's not even chronological, it's least to most. Oh, pfft, they're trash, dude. They're trash. They had some in the 80s, though. They have they have a few, but not many. Not many in the modern era. Yeah, not, not all the way down. There could be worse. That, that's a good spot for them, I think. Tigers? Uh, I don't, I think they're better than pirates. They're not great, but they're better than pirates, I'm pretty sure. They've had a few competitive squads. Least? Is that really least of all time? I don't know. Cubs. Oh, Cub, they, I mean. That's, that's gotta be the least, right? They, they only have like three ever. They had that curse going. Giants? Oh, they're pretty good. That's a pretty solid team right there. After Pirates for Cubs? Are you sure? Because like, the Cubs had that curse for like 100 years, didn't they? Maybe their early squad won a bunch of them. Dodgers? Yeah, Dodgers are good. They probably have more than Giants. Or do they? Because they always spend a million dollars and their team suck. I don't know. Put, I, I put them after Giants, probably. I'm not sure, though. Cardinals. Cardinals are good. Cardinals are dynastic. They're probably better than the Tigers, at least. 1900s, they won like six and ten years. Oh, I didn't know that. I didn't know they were that good back in the day. Crap. Zero. The Marlins actually... Is the Marlins one? Did they win one in like 1999 or something, or is it zero? It's very low, whatever it is. Put it really low. Marlins have one, okay. Oh, they have two. Okay, still still low though, still low. Yankees, a million. Yankees got a trillion of them. They're super winners, unfortunately. They got the most. No, 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 go, go, no, no, most, 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 most. Plumpus, no, Plumpus, what have you done, Plumpus? Rant sacks. Let's go, rant sacks. Okay, how we do, how we do. You've sorted them all. Let's see your score. Not great. Okay, that, that's on me for not knowing baseball. The only sport I follow, I don't even know it. Oh god, nothing. This is not a good round, guys. New it's not prompt. going well. Think fast. Sea animals by depths they can dive. Oh From god, what a what a sentence. Not so deep to very deep. The narrator probably hated the writer on that one. Sea animals by depths they can dive. Depths is a very hard word to say. Depths. Depths. It's hard to do. Need a good pop filter to filter out your plosives. Uh I guess they can swim. I don't know how far down they can go though. Salmon? Oh, salmon. They're, they're fish, dude. They're in the ocean. But they're they're only in the river, though. They're only in the river. I don't know. No, they can go in the ocean, though, right? They can, they can be in the ocean. What is... <laughs> what is the Hadal Amphipod? Yeah, yeah, Hadal Amphipod's pretty good. It's a pretty good creature. It's one of the better creatures, I'd say, on my tier list of Amphipods. Giant octopus. That's gotta be. They gotta be way down there. They gotta be rolling down in the deep. When your brain goes numb, you can call it mental freeze. 
I feel like a doll amphipod in the ocean. <laughs> I feel like an amphipod. You blocked the trash. What are you doing? What have you done? What have I become? I gotta get a um. You know that meme that's going around of like the new ghost from Modern Warfare like staring in the car, like the sad music. I gotta get a stream alert for that. I can just play that anytime. That'd be great. My Swedish friend. Deep sea anglerfish? I mean, it's in the deep sea. It's got to be really far down there. It's in the ocean depths. Sea turtle? Eh. I mean, they, they, can, they can swim, but... That one turtle in Finding Nemo. No, don't, don't block the trash, Plumpus. Oh my god, Plumpus. Is there anybody in chat named Plumpus? We'll ban them. We will ban Plumpus right now. You're lucky you you're lucky you used a pseudonym. You're on my radar, Plumpus. You make a sad ghost emoji on Discord. I can make a sad ghost emoji on um on Twitch. And then you would just get it in the Discord for being part of the Twitch. Okay, this is this is terrible. This is not That's going very well. Blocks. Let's see how you did. Okay, we got two streaks. Okay, all right. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, don't block the trash. You can't block the edges. Like you see how you went off the edge? Don't do that. No, no blocking the edges allowed because that's where the trash goes Let in me later drop rounds. This on ya. Sports Captain, he said we stole from McDonald's. From oldest person to newest person. Okay, person of the year. Uh, let's just put him right there. Good middle ground. Michael Phelps, he's 2000s-ish. He can swim. He's got a game where you use the connect to swim. And probably doesn't work very good. But it, no, it's it's year of um year they got it though. He's he's literally dead. Nah, don't worry, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, Samantha Joust sounds like trash. Hey, he was in the football one last time. He's a bit of an NFL type character. Michael Jordan. Who? Just kidding. I know who that is, at least. He, he's no Samantha Joust, but he's okay. Peyton Manning. Move it, Plumpus. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Get out of the middle. Get out of the middle. Oh, God. We don't want to make a middle pillar. That's how we lose. Felix Johnson, fake. That's fake. That's not real, right? The actor from Space Jam. Yeah, yeah. I can feel Devin Nett's rage through the screen. It sustains me. Megan Rapid, though. Is that real? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Better learn fast, Plumpus. Better get on program. Dwayne Wade. Ugh. 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 <laughs> Sorting what? It says on the screen. Oh, God. Oh, no. We're getting boxed in. We're getting boxed in big time. Ab Lincoln. That's not real. But can you get to the trash in time? Nope. He just made it worse. <laughs> disaster. Total disaster. Total disaster round. It's okay. We, we got a 10 kill streak. Watch. Watch my chopper gunner. My chopper gunner will come save us.
Oh, no streaks at all. We don't even have we don't even have 10,000 points yet. We don't have 10,000 yet and we're on round 4. We get like 7 average. We should have 21,000 by now. And we're at 9,000. Ready for the next one? Here it comes. Okay, can we survive? Stephen King books. Okay. Stephen King books. We got From this. Oldest book to newest book. We just put everything in the trash. I just put it all in the garbage. Garbage garbage round. Put it all in the garbage. <laughs> put it in the trash. None of these books are real. All right, Plumpus, put it in the garbage. Go all the way to the right. All the way to the right, Plumpus. Hit right. Hit the right arrow. Keep going. 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 <laughs> there you go, Plumpus. The trash strategy. We're not going to get any points from this, though. We're just stalling forever. Garbage disposal, what a way to go. Garbage disposal. Make sure and show. Oh yeah, that's right, the trash does pop back up. Okay, um, just just go right and then put it, don't put it in the trash, put it down on the board somewhere. Starting now. I'm ending this charade. All right, Carrie, Carrie's the movie. That's the movie one. I put it there. That's the newest one. Hit the clown. No, don't block it. Yeah, don't block the trash. Hit the clown. That was a scary movie. It was scary when he danced. Cell? That sounds fake. That sounds like some kind of mitochondria propaganda. Salad fingers. <laughs> it's not Stephen King. <laughs> what are you doing, Devadat? What have you done? Suicide. Suicide. The fear of rusty spoons against my salad fingers. That's all of them. Let's see how you stack. Honestly, up. salad fingers does seem like a Stephen King coked out creation. If we're gonna be honest here. All right, that was awful. It was absolutely horrible. Yeah, give him back. Give him back. <laughs> we won? Yeah, we win. We did it. We won. That was... We really, really dropped the ball today, team. I will not be taking us to Pizza Hut after that one. Cell wasn't fake. Wow, I can't believe it. Yeah, what a, what a great score to sign our legacies onto. Right, guys? All I can say is, yikes. But, but Coach McGurk, we, we never win. Yeah, yeah, I know, Brendan. I know we never win, but the thing is, I didn't bring any money. I don't, I'm don't. i broke right now, Brendan. I had to pay rent to my landlord. I had to pay rent to my landlord, Brendan, so I don't, uh, I don't have any money for food right now. Oh, really? Yeah. Can you guys just, like, eat... Eat some, eat some nature, eat some mushrooms. You, you want us to eat the mushrooms that, that grow in the field? Yeah, 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 Brendan. Can you guys just uh, eat those? That would help me out a lot, actually. Is Cell a short story? Let's find out. Stephen King Cell. Is Cell wet bones? It's a horror novel. It's a novel, okay. It follows a New England artist struggling to reunite with his young son after a mysterious signal broadcast over the global cell phone network turns the majority of his fellow humans into mindless, vicious animals. Oh, God. So everybody gets a phone call. If you answer the call, you become a zombie. That's crazy, dude. That sounds like a David Cage game. I'd play that game. It's also not a very good movie. <laughs> the premise is not very good. So I'm sure the movie is bad, too. Is there a Wet Bones movie? There's still no Wet Bones movie. Here's a description for Wet Bones, though. A flesh and soul devouring addiction runs rampant through the dark plague on a Hollywood elite in this tale of horror from the Bram Stoker Award winner. He won an award? Hey, cheer up, Brendan. I pocketed a bunch of granola bars in the teacher's coffee room. You can have some of those. Struggling Hollywood screenwriter Tom Prentice. <laughs> <laughs> That's where Prentice is from, Tom Prentice. 
can hardly believe the emaciated and mutilated corpse lying on the morgue slab was once his ex-wife. Then, his roommate's missing brother turns up in a local hospital, having sliced open his own chest and legs for some sick, inexplicable reason. In Oakland, the Reverend Garner, I almost said Reverend Gamer, the Reverend Gamer, a recovering addict, leaves his ministry in search of his teenage daughter, who was last seen in the company of her ghoulish kidnapper. <laughs> a ghoul. A ghoul got her. From the graveyard. And the Los Angeles police are meanwhile baffled in their hunt for the elusive Wet Bones killer, who leaves nothing behind of his victims except for damp, grisly pile of bones. <laughs> it just leaves a pile of bones. Though Tom, the Reverend, and the LAPD are on separate quests for answers, they are all being led into the darkest shadows of Hollywood, where the debauchery never ceases and pleasure is a drug that devours human flesh, blood, and sanity. But the true source of the all-consuming addiction is the most horrifying revelation of all, for it is not of this rational earth. From International Horror Guild award-winning author John Shirley, the acclaimed splatterpunk classic Wet Bones combines the monstrous inventiveness of H.P. Lovecraft with the exquisite excess of Clive Barker, a true masterwork of modern horror. It's decidedly not for the faint of heart. That's Wet Bones. Only one man could have got these bones, so what? Okay, hang on, let's, let's pull up Caffeine Man real quick. We got some Caffeine Man to watch. That brief super like, why did my bones? Mm hmm. Okay, here comes Caffeine Man. Energy drink review incoming. Just kidding, I fooled you. It's still Ninja. Ninja Nomics is cool, calm, collected. The opportunity to be on the Tesla, for me, means the world. It gives me the opportunity to put my foot in the door in the industry that I've wanted to deal with my entire life. I fix some QVC in there for friends and family, electronic repairs and such and so forth, but I used to work in a hospital. Right now, I currently live in Bronx, New York, around Thorns Neck area. Like it's like a time that we fight for the drama. Can't get that up, but watch out for the karma. I'm gonna put us on the map big time, believe it. The advantage I feel I have with the other competitors is that I'm a well-seasoned gamer. I don't just go after trophies. I go hard on my games. If you give me a shooting game, I'm gonna max out my character, I'm gonna make sure I'm a good teammate. I work with guilds, I work with clans, I do it all. My number one favorite video game. Period, I would have to say <laughs> he no. does it all. Looking at me is uh, the deepest story. I mean, Metal Gear Solid 4 was long enough to be considered uh, 12 full length movies worth of cinematic alone. Choose to live like the He's a Metal Gear fan. The from a backpack. For the vapors, you want to hear something that's retarded? Liquid, right? The Metal Gear. That's solid. Oh, whoa, whoa, I'm whoa. Ninja, you can't say that word no more, Ninja. That That's not okay anymore. Sorry, Ninja. You're you're out of here. I fear most is drowning. He's gone. Oh, I'm going to make my competition drown in my tears of joy as I wait for this victory. I'm here to prove to myself and my family and friends that being a gamer is not just a pastime. There is something in the future for people who are willing to devote themselves to something of this magnitude. Viral infection has spread to the people who want a resident that is evil. Me, my Valentine is the root. I'm my passion is covered. I have a keen eye for level design and finding bugs and tricks and stuff. And level design. And I just like making things as aesthetically perfect and functionally perfect as possible. I've always wanted to not only enjoy video games as a whole, but to help the enjoyment of others. One of my silence and bitches looking for days. How's that? <laughs> oh yeah, that was, that was really good, Ninja. Could you rap some more? This is gold, guys. This is gold. They're gonna love this. They're gonna love this. <laughs> DQ'd. Alright, Caffeine Man. Here, here's Monster Java Vanilla Light. Okay. This is what you all came to see. Caffeine Man here, and today I have another coffee review for you. Monster Java Vanilla Light. Coming right up. Look at the shirt, dude. The costume on fly, as always. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. I post new videos every Tuesday night. Look at that. One of the weekends. In this video, I'm doing the Monster Java Vanilla Light. I saw this in the store. Looking pretty good. Excited. I know uh, it sounds weird that I got excited about a monster product, especially a coffee monster product. But uh, when I did my original Monster Java review, I was a bit skeptical and hesitant. But overall, I was pleasantly surprised. They didn't score super, super high, but they scored higher than I thought they would. So if you want to know everything there is to know about Monster Java, I go over the ingredients in the drink and do a taste test. And the one that I was missing was this Vanilla Light, and that's what I was upset about, which is why I was so excited when I saw it. Because when it comes to coffee drinks, uh, I tend to be someone who likes them uh, light and sweet, and to not have the Vanilla Light was uh, was upsetting because uh, it's usually the vanilla flavor and the light. I so quiet. Turn them up. Pull away from that strong oh, because I muted Ninja. That makes sense. And I really thought the vanilla would. And people even left me comments saying, you gotta try that vanilla if you see it. I finally saw it. I picked it up. Reviewing it for you guys today. And since I went over all the information in that other video, all I'm doing today is a taste test. Well, let's taste it out. <laughs> Thank you. Very kind of you. And if you didn't say bless you, why not? Bless you. It's just a video. I can't hear you. But bless you, Caffey, man. Sorry. I'm, I didn't know he expected me to respond. I didn't know this was, a, this was an interactive. Thank you. You're a complete stranger, and you were nice to me. I need more niceness in the world. So I didn't know it was a back and forth. Crap. Now I feel bad. That's a whole other story. People think that they're being like Now I feel bad. And most people are taking the religious aspect out of it, and they just want the person to not get sick. What am I talking about? It's time to taste it out. And here's the camp. 
Out of all your Monster Java cans, this is the latest one, which makes sense because it is vanilla light, but it is mostly like a white, maybe even an off-white, a cream-colored can, a very light cream-colored can. And then it actually does have some graphics on there, uh, like some of their other drinks, and they're in more of a, a beige color than your typical uh, Monster Java logo in a nice dark brown. Oh, oh, what? Well, shake gently. Mm -hmm. Contents may settle. I'm trying to remember if it was my first video, or if it was my Monster Java 300 video, or some other coffee video, where it says shake gently. The door of the explorer, yeah. It's put it all over me, so uh, be sure to check out my other videos if you haven't watched them yet, because you'll find out all about the Java Monster, as well as the 300s, as well as the cold brew. That's right, I also reviewed their cold brew, too. I'll probably put pictures there like I always do, but then I hold it like this for a second or two, and I wait, and sometimes I jump cut it, sometimes I just keep talking, because I don't want it to explode on me. That should be long enough. Let's taste it out. There we go. No explosion. Almost like I know what I'm doing. It's all about learning through experience. Sometimes something bad happens to someone, and then they just keep doing it. Or you can have something bad happen to you, and you can learn from your experience. I highly recommend learning from your experience. Experiences. Learn from your experiences. I recommend not doing that. I recommend not learning from experience. Continue doing the same wrong thing over and over again until it drives you insane. That, that's my advice. You can choose Caffeine Man's advice or mine. But the, the choice is yours. You know, we got a nice coffee color here. Uh, I would say it's a touch lighter than some of the other ones, but it's been a while since I reviewed the other ones. But uh, it does seem like a slightly lighter coffee color in general. Let's taste it out. And when it came to the coffees for the Monster Java, uh, it did have a little bit of that uh, monster <laughs> Wisdom, man. Kind of way. It really uh, let you know that I'm uh, more of an energy drink. I'm starting a new coffee. advice channel called coffee. Wisdom, man. Saying, the cold brews that they came out with were less energy drinkish. Now let's taste it out. 200 milligrams of caffeine and caffeine, man. I gotta tell you about the caffeine content. So, uh, 200 milligrams of caffeine, and uh, if you drank Monster Java a long time ago, it used to be 188 milligrams of caffeine, but uh, they switched that over uh, a little while ago. They, they really felt that that 12 milligrams well, was important, so, so they give me a 200 now. Let's taste it out. All right, you guys were right. I am so excited that I found this drink. That is really, really, really good. Uh, and what's good about it is, listen, if you like coffee and you like coffee flavors and you like strong coffees, bold coffees, that's not for you. You're not going to want that. But if you're someone who likes your coffees extra sweet, extra cream, extra sugar, extra, extra, uh, then you're probably going to like that. If you like your Dunkin' extra, extra, or your Starbucks extra, extra with a vanilla shot in there, uh, you're going to like this because this is, that's pretty much what this is. And uh, I don't know if it's still a New England thing, but in New England, they had this autocrat coffee syrup. Uh, I'll put a picture of it there. It was a coffee syrup that you added to. Autocrat coffee syrup. Hmm. Never seen that in my life. Milk, so you can have coffee flavored milk. And the reason I say I'm not sure if it's still a New England thing is that because uh, certain states, certain regions used to have things that were just specific to their area. Like, oh, when you go here, you have to try this. When you go here, you have to try that. The thing is, we live in a world now where we have the internet and you can actually buy anything you want from anywhere. So you can probably buy autocrat. It's not like they're going to say, wait, you don't live in New England? No, 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 you can't have that. Therefore, uh, a lot more of you may have had the autocrat coffee syrup. And if you did, then you know that basically you're adding coffee flavor to your milk, but it's still mostly milk. And that's what this kind of reminds me of, except a little bit better because it has vanilla. And, and Co so coffee syrup is it's like reverse adding, instead of adding milk to your coffee. You add coffee flavor to your milk. I'm not. That's an interesting concept. Never heard of that before. So you have some warm milk and you pour coffee flavoring into it, huh? I gotta try some autocrat, dude. And I haven't had I some autocrat syrup. syrup. A long time we live in a real world. But, but this isn't an autocrat commercial. This is a Monster Java review, and uh, it's a really good flavor, and I like it because it is, uh, it's much more of a vanilla, a creamy vanilla drink with a little bit of coffee flavor in there. So if you're someone who likes a light coffee flavor, interesting, it's, interesting. You, it's definitely it for me. So when I put it on the caffeine man rating chart, it's probably going to be pretty high because I really, really like it. I try not to let personal preference get in the way of the flavor. And uh, like I said, uh, if I was basing it on flavor alone, saying it's not that strong of a coffee, that would be one thing. But it's not just about being a coffee flavor. It's about flavor in general. And since I'm telling you, it's not a so strong like coffee, Nesquik, you know but a liquid. And Nesquik is a coffee flavor. And if you like light vanilla coffee, they are giving you what they're saying on the can. And I'm going to be giving this a nine point. I guess it's like, I guess it's like a coffee and that's what I would, up if I would look for something uh, vanilla, creamy, touch of coffee, and a nice caffeine count at 200 milligrams of caffeine. It also makes it my top rated Monster Java flavor. So, so, so a great job. Hopefully, it's Monster not from Java. Nestle. I know this product has been out on the market for a long time. I, I don't support the Nestle. I know when I picked they only had three flavors. It's really hard to find all seven flavors. And to They're be honest, worse than most Amazon. Because I know a lot of people have been saying they can't find it anymore. Lots of limited shelf space on there. So, with the amount of drinks that companies like Monster and other companies come out with, it's really hard to keep everything on the shelf. But I'm happy to see Vanilla Light is still on the shelves. Thank you so much for joining me. And until next time, have yourselves a great day. Or night. Thank you so much, Caffeine Man, for that informational video. Now it's time to do something that I'm ashamed of each and every time. Is there a caffeine song? Caffeine song. There's several caffeine songs, okay. Okay, I'm not listening to that one. No thanks. No thank you. Yeah, we're just going to go with the classic Kimber Nightcore. Got to go Kimber Nightcore. Hello, spammy TV. This is a normal stream. This is a very normal stream. Don't worry about it. Pretty average Twitch stream. My Consuela is leveled up now. That's good. Uh, gotta do finger cutter challenge. For sure.
Is that a robot devil challenge? Is that a new one? I haven't seen that one yet. Robot Clash. Oh my god. I gotta do the Robot Clash. Starts in five days. Okay. It's a post-Thanksgiving battle. If you just clip this with no context, that, that explains the stream pretty well, I feel. Oh, my Peter almost leveled up. Let's go, Peter. See, here, here's my nefarious scheme. On YouTube, I always post violent action games, and everybody watches me on YouTube, and they go, oh, this, this guy's probably streaming an FPS game. And they come over, Family Guy card game every time. My Twitch content is just the Family Guy card game and nothing else for 24 hours a day. Any songs about cover? <laughs> Gears of War fan song. Take cover, maybe. Like a JT Raps Gears of War song might be that. 13 victories, holy crap. I'm too powerful. It was against the crappiest guy ever, though, so not that impressive. <laughs> Carlos, his men, dubs them. Too many of Carlos' men, man. Claim the rewards. This is, this is the emotional part. This is the sad part of the song. Open up your heart. Come on, guys. Let's crack a legendary card. Do people find the game fun? Uh, you can get Bapo the Clown, so yes. You're telling me Bapo the Clown is not fun? Dude, we got the legendary Boppo. Let's go. We got a Boppo. I do not see the appeal. It's pretty fun. It's a pretty fantastic game. Shut up, Kimber. Um, is there going to be a song about cover? Let's see. Gears of War cover song. Gears of War main theme. What's the main theme of Gears of War? It has a theme you can sing. Okay, it's just instrumental. I, I thought it was going to be singing, because it's a picture of somebody singing. Gears of War rip em up song. Here we go. That's too long. It's like six minutes long. Gears of War gameplay launch trailer. God of War Ascension. God of War. God of War. Gears of War. Mad World. They made a Mad World for Gears of War 3. Way to phone it in. Evanescence the Chain from... Wait, what? Evanescence did a cover of the Chain for Gears of War? What? Cryo Shell. We need Cryo Shell. This is the one I want. No, no, no. Creeping in my soul is better. Hang on. Bye bye Babylon. This is this is the one you want right here. This is the song. Song of the decade. I want this to play in Halo. Wake me, can you hear me calling? Out of darkness they go calling you am I on you and you be creeping in your soul. She's in the room from Trivia Murder Party. What are we doing? What am I doing right now? We're just we're just watching <laughs> Evanescence covers. Okay. Uh tomorrow. Maybe more game jam story, because I, I did get a whole video out of that Uncharted clip we played today. But maybe I'll find another crap. There, there's a few more crappy Steam games that got recommended to me when I bought that Uncharted clone. So we might look at them. But we'll see. This stream has devolved into just watching YouTube videos, which usually means it's time for the stream to be over. You promise more Tester. Yeah, we'll, play, we'll watch more Tester tomorrow. We'll keep watching a Tester tomorrow as well. But when, when I just pull up YouTube and just start browsing, that's when you got to end it. Eventually, I'll put on media share. Eventually, you can pay me five bucks to watch a video. But for now, watching a video signals the end of the stream. I need, need a couple hundred thousand more subscribers on YouTube. Then we can open up the media share. How about that? But let us see what Erica like. There was a few FMV ones on my wish list. Media share pong. Woo. 
Obo reacts? Uh -huh. You know I'm going to react dressed as Ghost. I'm going to turn on the face cam, and I'm going to be dressed in a Simon Ghost Riley cosplay. And whenever the face cam is on, I'm going to talk like this. I'm going to talk in my ghost voice. The streams will only be like two minutes long, because it's very taxing on my throat. I can't do it for very long, mate. All right, who's live on Twitch right now? We got Mopey Lloyd, we got uh, Mopey Lloyd and Red Knight. All right, those are your choices. Pick your poison. Play Omicron. I should play Omicron. I need a walkthrough to play Omicron with. That's the thing. Say the Joker line as Ghost. Why so serious? I might. Why so serious? Good to see you, mate. Pick up a serious from the table. You guys want Red Knight or Mopey Lloyd? Pick your poison. The first one I see will dictate what I do. Jaden Animations, no. That's not one of the choices. The choices are Mopioid and Red Knight. The real Red Knight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I tried to raid Sly Cooper fan last night, and I raided Sly Cooper fan instead of Sly Cooper fan. I forgot to capitalize the S, so we raided some dead channel that hasn't streamed in like 10 years. Whoops. Okay, now we're going to raid Red Knight for real. Slash raid. I believe Red Knight is still playing Elden Ring. If my theory is correct, he's playing Elden Ring as we speak. So thanks for watching. Thanks for like, favor, subscribing. I think we got enough subscriptions today to recoup the cost of Bad End. And also the developer of Bad End said he's going to give me free keys for the new Soldier games. That'll be good. Uh, speaking of free keys, I might be getting a free key for the Callisto Protocol. Let's go. But what happened is uh, some marketing agency emailed me. And they were like, you want a free key for the Callisto Protocol? All we ask is that you make content about it and enjoy it with your community. And I was like, I mean, I'll take a, I'll take a free Callisto Protocol key. But also, I'm not going to like guarantee positive coverage. Like, If there's parts of the game that suck, I'm going to say this part of the game sucks. And they haven't responded back to me. So... I think maybe what I was supposed to do was say, yeah, and then, only, then wow, this game is great. So I don't know. But if, if, they're, if they're cool with those terms, then I will be getting a free Callisto Protocol key. If they're not cool with those terms, I'll be purchasing the Callisto Protocol anyway and playing it on December 2nd when it comes out. So, yeah, that's what's going on with Callisto Protocol. Don't ever not sell out. Oh, crap. That, I, was, I was not selling out the whole time. I should have never not sold out. Dang it. Well, I'm gonna go, I got to go email that guy again. I got to go grovel at his feet for a review copy. Hang on. Uh, enjoy Red Knight stream. See you guys later.